Okay, where is the recent good one? I guess I'll open the both of these. Figure out which is better in a minute. Yo, golf. I will actually start on it in just a minute now. Just uh, announcing my stream in the Scrabble Discord and getting the board together. Oh, a bunch of people. Oh my goodness. Three whole people. Yo, Chloe. Yo, Forlo. Thank you for the GL with the tassing. Thank you, Golf Kid, for the sheeps. Yeah, so... I... There's a few concessions that I'm going to make in this version of the TAS. I'm not going to worry about RNG at all. I don't want to think about it. I don't want to think about it, so I'm just not going to. So, the main goal with this task is I have a board that people smarter than me put together. I actually have two boards. Uh, I'm not positive which of them is necessarily the better one. Um, this one was posted later. Um... But I don't know that there was consensus about which one of these two is actually better. Um, this one uses blanks for both of the A's, so I'm inclined to use this one. I think Orange Triangle said this one has more cursor movements overall, I think? So I'm, I'm probably just going to go with Joking, Quinate, etc. And... Should I should I double check that all of these words are in the dictionary? I assume they did. But I don't I don't know for sure. Also, I I should put on music. Hold on. What music should I put on? What do I want to listen to? I want to listen to I want to listen to some of this. Okay. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna open up Sisyva and just, just double check that all the words are in here. Oh, and I haven't done my Sisyva today. Whatever, I can do that later. That doesn't need to happen right now. Okay. Joking. Good. Quinate. Good. Fixtures. Good. Uh, I should be more systematic about this. Uh, beveled. I'll just follow this path. Epilogue, of course, is good. Weather is good. Buttery is good. Laminar, coinage, I, I assume all of these are, it's not like these are complicated words. Uh, suavely, yep. Favored, but you just, you never know, you never know when it turns out a, uh, a word was invented a couple years ago or something. Dictate. Riatas? No idea what Riata is. It's a lasso, of course. Yo, Manly. For birthday dinner. Happy birthday, Manly. Everybody in chat, wish Manly a happy birthday right now. I swear to God, if you don't do it, I'm gonna cry. Manly deserves to have a happy birthday. Um, we're on, yep, we're on a nowhere. Anagrams, of course. Squeeze, weirdly, prairie, yogurts, caution, achieve, extant, amplify... Yowled. Ooh, that's a good one. That's a neat one. Uh, vanilla, dominoes, forgets. Jukebox, also a fun word. Triads, adoring. Bandeau. 
A headband. Okay. Um. Princess, what are you doing? She's she's trying to climb the mattress. There she goes. She stopped like halfway up. You silly kitty. Um, I'm gonna go with this board. I'm gonna go with the board that has the both of the blanks or A's. Um. Yeah, that was the main thing I had to figure out. So now we just we just get it going. Weird cats. There are a couple... There are a couple of things that I need to do before the run starts. Um, I want to I wanna check some menu things to see what I should do to make that right. Yep, scrabble, scrabble, scrabble. Can I... Oh, I'm not... I am recording inputs. Where's... Uh-oh. It- what? <laughs> Wait. It's taking the analog inputs, but nothing else. That's not good. Hold on, let's just- let's go back. Go back, go back. Go back way before, actually. Um... Oh, God, I... Can I really not- whatever. Whatever, just... Does not matter. Reboot. Don't save changes. Do I have to close Task Studio? Why do I have to close Task Studio? I don't anyway. This. Where is the menu I want? How do you set your controls? It's right there. I always forget where it is. Okay. There we go. That's what I needed. Let's try this again. Tassing is hard, okay? Yes, inputs are working now. Thank you, Muzz, you're right. I, I'm i also shaking my head. I can't just say that when I have a webcam on, can I? I just... No one will believe it. I can't get away with just blatant lies like that. The Super Mario News. I don't think I did. What was the Super Mario News? Can I buffer this? No. No, I can't. Can I... Can I skip that any sooner? Oh, that news. Yeah, no, I did hear that. I follow Cosmic. Did... Did you see it because of Cosmic's video on it? Get out of here, extra inputs. Um, uh, Muzz, I'm just gonna send you a screenshot real quick. Um, hold on, hold on. Let's see, let's see. Ah, uh, here we go, and there you go. I- oh my god! Cats, what are you doing? <laughs> Princess just leapt off of the mattress like a, a- I don't know, like she was attacking something, like she was pouncing at something off of it. Weird cat. Yo, Orange Triangle. Um, hey! Which of these boards is better? Did we come to consensus on this? This one was posted later, the one with Extant. But it sounded like you posted a few points where it was worse. I'm, I think I'm going with this one, the last one you posted. Um, but was there, was there consensus about this that I forgot about? Just off the top rope. It'll be a bit before I actually start making the tasks anyway, so it's not a big deal, but just just wanted to double check that. The one with extant is better. 
Good to know. Okay. I will use that. <laughs> yep, Dustin. Okay. Um, I'm doing simple things that I really shouldn't be worrying about, but, like, I am anyway. Uh, what is the earliest that I can skip this? That's the question. I can skip this very early. Wow. Hold on. No, not that early. Not that early. Is it just, like, right after that red line? Is that... No, it's gonna be later than that, surely. I think I've jumped way too far back. I think that's the problem. Okay, so that works. That does not... That does. No idea where the, the menuing inputs are. Okay. Uh, and then what's the earliest I can skip this? I assume it's somewhere around here. Looks like it's that. These cats, oh my god. My roommate is out visiting his family across the country. So I'm trying to just leave the door to my office open. Just so that the, uh, you know, the cats don't get lonely outside, but they do like charging all around this room when they can. Okay. Um, that's a good question. That's a fair point. In some games it does matter, in some it doesn't. Where was the last input? It had to be back here somewhere. There it is. No, it doesn't matter. Which means I can probably get rid of this one? Is that right? Or is it one of those, like, you need to hit it on the right half of the frame? Like, if I go there instead. Yeah, so that doesn't work, but this does. I see. So it's reading inputs every other frame. Okay. <clears throat> Why is my phone buzzing? No reason. Okay. Uh, I... Where's the first actual frame? Is it this one? If I, like, press right here, would that... That does work. What if I press right, like, back here? Is there... Is there some amount of input buffering? There is... So I press right here, that doesn't go away till the next frame, and then at this point, it, uh, it shows up and takes the input. Okay. This. Uh, first menu frame. I'm gonna need to go back to this a few times. There are some things that I want to look at in the options menu. Uh, because auto pick tiles, we're gonna have to turn that off. We need that off. Miss turn on invalid word does not matter. Rack order, though. Does this randomize our rack every turn? That's that's the main question I have. Because if it does, then it doesn't matter what order I pick the tiles. Um, you know, ideally, you have some kind of consistent rack where you play tiles, and then the tiles you didn't play, like, go up front, or stay in place, or whatever, and, uh, you know, stay in the same position in the rack, but if we don't have anything like that... The tiles were in the order I picked. Okay, so, leave it on random, I guess, because there's no way I hit alphabetize or value there. 
Um, should we turn on a timer just for the memes? <laughs> yeah, the timer probably does lose time. That's true. Okay. So all I need to do is turn off auto-pick tiles. That's... that's it. Okay. Um, and what if I hold right for a few frames there? I can't buffer this, can I? Holding right is just gonna... Probably because of that lag frame. No, it looks like it did eventually go... Change the color. I could. I'm typing my name in as cheater anyway, so it's not like it matters. Yeah, there we go. That's what I wanted. Uh, and what happens if I do right and X there? Nothing. Okay. And X on the next frame, I... Ooh, okay, okay. Good point. Is this our first optimization? No, you can't press left to, to wrap around. That was a good thought, though. Um... And no, you can't press up here, either. Nope, wrong button. Q is what I wanted. There we go. Okay, so press X. Uh, can I just immediately start pressing down? I can. And then I want up a bunch of times. I'll check it here, too. Yeah, okay, no, I do need to... Oh, gosh, wait a second. Wait, wait, there's one more thing I need to check with these menus. What? Get out of here, analog inputs. If I, if I alternate, um... Yeah, it looks like that's not really accomplishing much. Actually, analog isn't doing anything for this. Oh, okay, that's why. Never mind. Good to know. Is that what I want? Nope, too far, too far. I wasn't counting. Ooh, another good question. Let's find out. No, right isn't doing anything there. Oh, I'm in the wrong menu, goddammit. <laughs> Three down inputs. Okay, so that's three it should be to bring me to rack order. Miss, auto pick off. That works. Uh, and then real quick, just gonna throw that down there. Can I hit anything? Triangle gets me out of it, but it doesn't, it undoes the input I did, so I do need to actually menu all the way back down. Two, three, four, five, X. Yep. Um... Yeah, triangle auto leaves the menu. Like, orange triangle. No, it's a green triangle, I'm sorry. I... That's just, that's the way the controller was made. If orange triangle wants to change the name to orange circle, then, uh... Then you can be PlayStation themed, but unfortunately not the way things are right now. Um... Same question here. What what inputs can I do? I can press triangle to get out of this. And then I'm gonna wanna say play solitaire. Okay. So after X, triangle next frame? Yep, that works exactly. Uh, and then left, left, X, down? Yep. X, and that gets me here. 
where I will then say left x, uh, and then I need to count a, a little bit. I guess it'd be left up, left up, left. And then one more left. This does have wrapping, as I recall. Well, let's, let's try it. Let's find out. Yeah, it does. <laughs> Name Hector. That, that would actually be pretty funny. I'm doing it. I, I like the meme. Uh, okay, so where are we? Left, X. I, I do need both of those. Uh, and then I guess it'd be up. Up, left, up? No, it sends me over to the side. No lefts. Up, right, up, up. Uh... No, only one of those ups. Uh, and then it's three left. And then two left. And then the T is... Left, down, left, left, left. Oops. Uh, and then up, right. And then right, or left, yeah. Down, left, left, X. Um, and then... <laughs> This is so dumb. Um, yeah. Left, up, left. Uh, it didn't work when I tried it on the menu earlier, but let me... I can check. Um, where am I right now? I'm on F. So if on this input... Oops. I also hit X. Yeah, it just doesn't take the X input. Uh, one more left, and then X, and then I think start? Anything? That backs out. Okay, not triangle. Uh, I assume not select either. Yeah, no, I think I just need to go all the way back to the, the play button. Um... So I was just thinking, I do have a foot pedal. Would it be easier for me to use the foot pedal to go back and forth on inputs than to use my hand in the keyboard? But no, I think my ankle would get really tired after a while. Okay. Um, after E... I guess it would be faster to go left. Wait, is up not... It doesn't wrap up and down. Oh. I, I thought it would. Okay. There appears to be a gap there. That is a lag frame. It's not going to, uh, to take input there. Yo, Jacobo. Jacobo, the community's been so hard at work on this. Um... I want this. Uh, real quick, I don't have the letters for triads already, right? I don't... I don't have triads. That's unfortunate. However, uh, we need to exchange once. We need to exchange, and then we can pick tiles. Um, I have some of the letters for triads, so I don't need to exchange everything. And that... I think that helps. Uh, we need triads, and then either... 
We can keep the O for adoring. <laughs> or we can keep the O for dominoes, or we can keep the M for dominoes. I think I should do adoring bando and then Domino's forgets jukebox and kind of work around the board like that. That's my instinct. I don't think it should matter much which way we do it. <laughs> I don't think we're going to make a new board that fast. Um, unfortunately, Golf, we learned it's actually not optimal to get bingos in the solitaire tasks. Apparently, the bingo animation takes too long. Oh, do we want a frame count on that, actually? I can play Modesty, and we can learn how much longer in terms of the exact number of frames a bingo takes. I'm gonna do that. I'm actually gonna do that right now. Step one. Uh, I should... I should make some notes. I'm gonna open a Google Doc. Uh, just gonna make a... Scrabble... Frame... Notes. Um... Yeah. Okay. When... Do our inputs start to matter? Real quick. Cause it's not gonna be for a while. Oh my god, those cats. Just... Uh, hold on. It's just, both of these cats are so... They're so noisy. They do so much. Look at them up there. Tobin, what are you doing? He just climbed up there and had to jump over his sister to to actually stand up there. Wild things. Wild cat things. Okay. Let's, uh, let's get some, some actual data. Okay. <clears throat> let's, uh, real quick. Yes, that works. That works. That works. That does not. That does not. That does not. That's the first time our inputs matter. Okay. I want to play modesty. Uh, I want to play modest and then modesty. That's what I want to do. So let's just use this as a chance to get a little bit of data. Um, can we... Does this need to be every frame also? Hold on. Or is it just that? Can I do that to... No, we do have to wait a little bit. I do remember this. I think it's two frames. Two frames at 30 FPS, rather. It is it's two frames at 30 FPS between cursor inputs. Uh, however, can we do a right there? We Or an X there, we can. We'll also, ideally, get some, uh, some frame data that can confirm or reject that hypothesis. Because, I mean, maybe, I don't know, we'll see. We'll see how much it matters. Um, rack, oh my god, please, rack. Cursor inputs. Um, it's at 30 FPS, basically. As opposed to the main menu cursor inputs. Golf, what do you mean by you dealing? I feel like I missed 
a sentence. Um, how does this work? Is it up? It's been so long since I've even played Scrabble. I think it's up, right? It is up. Uh, up and then X to place. No, it takes an extra frame. Takes an extra several frames? That's not right. Ideally, I see, I gotcha. Okay. It's some number of frames and then I hit X. I'm not crazy. Do I need to hold X? There's no way that's right. I do remember it just like taking a while. My goodness. Uh, not quite golf. Almost, but not quite. Um, we can pick our tiles manually. There's a game mode for that. Okay. After <laughs> picking a tile and going up from the rack, we need to wait how many frames? A lot. We need to wait a lot of frames. 66 to 80? Uh, but it's... At 30 FPS, we don't need to talk about 30 FPS, we can treat this as 60. It's basically 14 frames. 7 30 FPS frames. Basically a quarter of a second, which is surprising to me. I'll, I mean, I guess that's just the way it is, though. Uh, the dictionary is on the speedrun.com page. It's in the resources. You can download it there. It has a little bit of junk data in it, unfortunately. I still need to... I haven't gone through and cleaned it. Um, it shouldn't be much junk data, it's just a few words. It's gonna miss a few words, basically. Okay, we pressed X. The thing is placed. Um. It should be the same amount of time either way, I think. And we can immediately start... Yeah, immediately start playing again. It was 98 plus uh, however many. That's going to be like 14. There's no way that's right. No, it's not because it's 12. Because if I tried 10, that doesn't work. That's... I'm surprised by how many that is. But it's the way it is, I guess. It is faster to go left here. Uh, 26 to what, like 40? Yes. Uh, it doesn't matter if we go left or right here. 54 to 68? Yep. Seventy four to eighty eight, uh, and then immediate express. No, that doesn't that doesn't work. One more frame. 
94 to 08. And then I want to end turn and see what happens. I guess the question is, after I hit the final express to end turn, how long is it before it brings up the menu to let us pick tiles? So this is going to be 3112 to some number. What? Oh, I... I bozoed it. There we go. 3112 to some number. Where did this menu come up? That's my main question. 3583. I assume we can input a couple frames before that, but I'd be... No, God, you're right, I should check on when inputs matter. That's what actually matters. Eighty, it looks like. Yeah, eighty. Thirty-five eighty. Okay. And then if we just go back and also add the Y. Oh! It saves us a cursor input also. <laughs> on the menu, so keep in mind that there's, like, the one saved frame from not having to scroll to the end turn button. Um, yeah, it's just that, X. Uh, 14 to 28. And then, I assume, 32. So this is now 3132. Yes. 20 frames later. And we get control. Well, I mean, no, really. Golf, what we're trying to figure out is how long does the bingo animation take? It's important overall to know that there's the saved input, but we want to know how long is the bingo animation taking. Okay, 34 works, 32 works, 30 does not work. 31 does not work, 32 does in fact work. 37, 32. 31, 32, wait. No, yeah, I'm sorry, that's right, yes. Math is not good in my brain. Uh, 3580 minus 3112, that's 468. Versus 3732 minus 3132 is 600. Uh, so that's 10 seconds versus... 7.8 seconds? I'm sorry, the bingo takes 2.2 seconds? Dustin, is that about what you were getting before? I thought you were getting closer to like one second. Oh, 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 oh no, I'm sorry, I forgot to take into account. There's an extra tile count. It counts the Y. I completely forgot. <laughs> there, There's more stuff to consider. Crud. Okay, how do we take that into account? I guess it would be... From the cursor moving to the last tile? That's the number we care about? That's the, the frame that we care about? Hold on, let me let me do this a different way. It's thirty-five thirty-three to thirty-seven thirty-two versus what happens when we don't play the Y. Thirty five thirty-three 
Yo, Dozer, we are Scrabble Tassing. I've made a couple of, like, test task things in the past, but, uh... But, yeah, this is the first theoretically good one. <laughs> Thirty-four forty-seven. To what should still be thirty-five eighty. Nope, not the button I meant to hit. Yeah, that's right. Okay, so one more try. One ninety-nine versus. 133. There we go. That makes more sense. Um, so that's 66 frames, 1.1 seconds for the bingo bonus animation. Does that put... Well then, but there's also the, uh, there is the extra cursor animation, which we determined took 20 more frames? No, wait. 20 frames to place the extra letter. No, it's only, like, a frame to move the cursor to, uh, the other spot, which is, it's negligible. So yeah, it's about 1.1 seconds for the bingo animation. But yeah, I mean, the point is, if those take even longer than we thought, then it's even more apparent that, uh, that bingos are not worth it for the, the solitaire tasks. Okay. So now we know that. We learned a little bit. We're learning. That's so good. Okay, now actual inputs. I didn't mean to hit tab. That's not what I wanted to do. I want to hit left, and then X, and then I don't remember the inputs. Ooh, here's a question. I could keep a bunch of tiles. <laughs> I could keep a bunch of tiles and pick the tiles I exchange, or I can just say exchange all and not need to select them. Because a bunch of the tiles I have are going to be used immediately. Because I have T, S, I have uh, O and M, I can keep one of those. Um... I suppose I should exchange all, because in theory you're gonna start with the with the right board anyway. That's true. That's also true. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Fair point. I will exchange all. So down X here. X on the next frame. Probably on the next frame then. Uh, and then I... one more on there? Yes. Okay. Uh, so now we get to do another fun part of this, where we need to... I get to figure out what all of these are. So I'm going to copy that, and open up Paint. Um, and just... throw that down, and I get to type all of this. Sucks that I have modesty. I should just move the letters into place, put them on the board, and then exchange. <laughs> I'll put it in the notes. Because that is pretty funny. Uh, I'm just going to have this on a second monitor. And I'm going to be going back to this frame a lot, so it doesn't matter. V, E, R... Bump up this font a bit. E R. Uh, 
O I H F uh, E E U N O G L E E U N O G L. Where am I going? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So the one after that. S blank I S I T. First row done. Cool. Liwexar. Revenge, plus, and, no, yeah, just revenge, neat. Did I go far enough? That's not, that is two R's in a row, I didn't, yeah, no, I did go far enough, okay. Um, yeah. And that is three E's in a row. And then the last six here. Oops. Nope, nope, go back. I wasn't recording. Ooh, a gob. Cool. Third row. <laughs> Uh, I have confirmed that, Golf. Is that the long-lost cousin of Muzzagrob? Yes. Only Muzz can confirm. Um. Oh, hold on. That album ended already. God, 43 minutes have passed. Once I get going, this shouldn't take long. A lot of this is just going to be set up. Okay, next row. E A Z O A C F Face Zoa. Um And then the last six. Oops. Okay. Fourth row. By the way, is the music too loud? I say not actually seeing chat right now because I, I have a window open over it. O U K L D I A O U. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. 
There's the other blank. Six, seven, E, W, O, T, O, J. And then last six. By the way, as I recall, there are diagonal inputs here, and you can do things like hitting up and down to jump the menu, so... We're not trying to optimize this menu, though. I don't want to optimize this menu, because if I try to do that, this is gonna take forever. It shouldn't, it shouldn't be that hard to figure out how to optimize this menu, but it's more work than I want to put in right now. It's perfect, good. You can barely hear the music at all, perfect. Good enough. That's like an FF14 ultimate raid. A hearty have Ukab, very good. Revenge isn't in order in the selection golf. Yeah, Dustin got it. You get the letters for it. Oh yeah, it is lower in OBS than I realized. I can touch it up a tiny bit. Okay. We, we have the... Get out of here. We have the, get out of here, the whole menu, <laughs> the whole thing. Do I do a lot of task stuff? I have done task stuff before. I do task stuff to prove, <laughs> not you golf, please, boo toaster. Um, I like using task tools to figure out what's possible in a game and to potentially help RTA runs. I I don't optimize tasks. I think that's extremely tedious, and I, I'm just not interested in doing that. Which is why, for example, right now I'm making a theory task and not an actual task. I also just want to point out real quick, this is five rows of 20 tiles, uh, which if you'll count, you'll notice is 100 tiles. So just as a reminder, um, in... PS1 Scrabble, when you exchange, the letters you have go back into the bag before you draw new tiles. Which is so dumb. It, that's not how Scrabble's supposed to work. Have a queue and you don't want it? Try to exchange, but there's a chance you'll just get it right back. So we need triads plus another letter. Triads plus a letter. And I think... Yo, eye surgery. Hello, hello. Also, golf. I don't think I actually said it, but thank you for contributing to the hydrate challenge. If the letters stay in the same order, I think that means we want to draw triads plus the N for wear on and play wear on last. Alternately, play extant last. Draw the T for extant. Or the D for yowled or whatever. No, I don't think it is the next tile I'd play because it... Wouldn't it stay on the end of the rack? What happens to the tiles you don't play? Do they get pushed to the front, or do they stay in their position? What happened in my last test? I don't remember. I genuinely don't remember. Or did I play bingos every turn, so it doesn't matter anyway? I don't remember what my first turn was. Yeah, I guess I'll just test. Um... What, what tiles do I get immediately if I just... Yeah, it doesn't matter. I can just take whatever. Okay, these are... Yeah, let's just... Do that, play her or whatever, figure out what happens to the other letters. V-O-I-F. Where do they end up on the rack? They end up at the front. They do get pushed to the front. You're right, Dustin. Okay, good. That makes this slightly more interesting. 
<clears throat> uh, what is the game that you're interested in, Andre? I do enjoy doing that kind of thing a little bit. Um, I just don't enjoy optimizing tasks beyond that. Because part of the stuff I have done is, uh, is, yeah, looking for memory addresses and stuff like that. Uncharted Waters. I don't know that one. I'll have to look that up sometime. Um, okay, okay. So, we want triads plus a little bit. Let me, uh... Let me just, uh, real quick, I can probably pretty easily... Can I just sneak this on to the desktop up here? Yes, I have to cover the lamb's face, unfortunately, and I do like that lamb a lot. I also need to shrink my fat webcam face some. And that's not, like, readable at all, is it? I should just keep this on my second monitor. <laughs> Never mind. Thank you, Dustin, for the sheep. Trading pirate sim of sorts with a two-scale map of the world, and anytime there's like 20 to 30 NPC ships that are somewhere in the world with their own behaviors. Oh. Okay, yeah, that stuff, that does sound interesting to try to figure out. Yeah, yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah, that would be cool. Um... I guess finding some of that stuff might be a little tricky, but it's not that hard to learn how to find memory addresses. I think it's something you could figure out, or be taught, at least. And suddenly they- yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I need triads plus the A for adoring. Triads plus A. So where am I going? I need a T. Okay, okay. Where's the S? Where's the closest S? Oh my god, there's no S's anywhere in this board. They're all super far to the right. The closest S is this letter. Or this one. This is the blank. That's fine, though. It happens. Um... Yeah, this is gonna be triads A. Okay. So... Down, down, down. Oh, yeah, what is this menu? This is also 30 FPS. Goodness. Unfortunate. That's the T, and then it's right. Uh, and right again. Actually, I wonder if we can do down right, up right? Ooh, 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 ooh. No, we can do, hold on, hold on. Sorry, there's a bunch of weird stuff in this menu. I swear I'm not gonna super optimize this. It's not fully 30 FPS golf. The main menu was 60. Spyro's the same way. Menus go at 60, everything up. Spyro's so weird. The visuals of the game update at 30, but the physics behind the scenes still go at 60. So pressing, like directional input matters at 60 fps but a bunch of other stuff is just 30 fps um so i think <laughs> after i select the t it's gonna push me over oh so i just need to hit right actually i don't need to overthink this uh that is also an i and then the A is going to be up from there. Um, it, it just all has to do with the way that the cursor gets pushed around. Um, like, it, it jumps across these gaps. But also, if you try to press diagonals along these gaps, 
their cursor can end up in unexpected places. We'll see. We'll see if we can play with that at all. Um, that, I just took the A, and then I pressed down, and then X again to get the D. And then it's going to be a whole bunch of... What, what do I want to do here, actually? Let's... Let's go down, I think. So we got the D, we go... We got the D. We go down. We go down again. And that sends us to the end. Where we then want to go... Up, left, up? No, it's gonna be... Up, up, left. What happens with that? No, that's just treated as a separate left input. That's a shame. Okay, well, that's the S for triads, and then... Oh, you know what? There is a closer O. However, at this point, if I press up left, where does it go? Yeah, you see, it does the left input. From this piece, I hit up left, which you would expect to go up left. But it does the left input, uh, which sends you here, and then up. So it's left up rather than up left. That's kind of the weirdness of this. If it's sending me there anyway, is the O faster to get than the A? <laughs> I don't think it is. Oh my god! Um, the only problem with this, no, there's antonym, yeah, yeah, I guess, I guess this should work. What are the blanks in this grid? Blanks are both A's. Um, and you checked all of these with this, uh, this dictionary? I mean, these all look like relatively common words anyway. I'd be surprised if, uh, I can check it real quick. That only took a second before. I checked both of the other boards anyway. I might as well do this one too. Modest, of course, is going to be there. Um, antonym. Antonym, but spelled correctly. Yes. Magnify. Yes. Jukebox, yes. Volcano, yes. Headway, yes. Soprano, of course. Big wigs, I know that one. Bully, yeah. Non slip. Soothe. Uh, dwarfs. Dw dwarfs, yes. Carroted, yep. Retrace, there it is. Aquaria, yes. Zeolite, I know because I learned all the Z's. And Reverie, yes, they are all in here, good. Oh, Carotid, yeah, that does... That does sound like a word I know. It feels quick to me too, Golf. People who are good at Scrabble are much smarter than me. <laughs> um... Yeah, this, uh, this works. Well done. <laughs> okay. Uh. Yeah, yeah, I'll go back. <laughs> That's fine, because, uh, this board is gonna be the same no matter what. So, we got it. <laughs> okay. Modest. Let's, uh, we need to actually have this up. I think, uh, an important part of casual Scrabble is making sure people are on the same page about the kind of game that you're about to play. Uh, yeah, okay, so... Right. Right. 
write x up 14 frames brings us to 80. No, wait. When can I start hitting left? Is it here? Is it before here? No, it is the same. Okay. And then the other question... I am doing right input. Uh, once you're on this menu, it's 30 FPS instead of 60. So if I tried to press R here, it just wouldn't take. It's only the main menu that is... Uh, that is 60 FPS. Uh, 66, I can start hitting left. Do I want to just hold left? Is that faster? Um... Is that faster or as fast as pressing left precise left? I don't know why it would be different. Is pressing up left and down left alternating gonna be good for any reason? Hold on. When can I even do another input? If zigzagging turns out to be fast in Scrabble, that's going to be hilarious. Just to check if it puts the rack in order. God damn it, you're right. I know you're right, but give me a minute. I need to figure out some other things. Once you're on the board, it takes 10 frames to... Hold on, let me not type that yet, because I do need to double check. If I hit L, how long until another L input takes? It's the same. And if it's the same, I'd rather do alternating up, left, down, left, because that's funny. And it's 8 frames, not, uh... Sorry, not 10. Oh, no, wait, is it 10? Did I... am I completely... It is 10. Hilarious. Okay. Yeah, I'll do... I'll do a couple of scrambles. It's just square. Um, oh gosh, but it's gonna be a different scramble depending on the frame I do it, isn't it? It is. There, M is in the right spot! <laughs> How close do we care to get? <laughs> this is so hilarious. Oh wait, also, sorry, hold on, one other thing to check. Uh, if we do that, is that the same as that? Yes, demoise it. Demoise it. Yes, that is the same. So it seems like it is just frame dependent, not... Not... Our inputs don't impact it. There's a problem? No! What's the problem? It's fine. I need to write down notes about, uh... About things anyway. Um... Bingo animation takes... Uh, 1.1, uh, I should say 66 frames at 60 FPS. Okay, um, when moving tiles, uh, tile movement takes 10 frames at 60 FPS, any direction. There's three Y's? Oh no! Where, why, antonym, headway, Magnify, you're right. 
Blank Y would still be good, but is it good enough? I, um, I could just keep playing around with randomizing this first rack a little bit. Because it would be really funny if we could manage to just luck into it. Only 11 is in 3 use. No! Okay. Should I go back to the triads board, or do you think you can put together another one fast enough that I can just keep playing around with modesty a little bit? It really is, isn't it? Um... Okay, let's, uh, let's play around a little more with, uh, with this. So, if we do a square input immediately, we can get the F, the M. And if we then do x up uh, for 58 to 72, I think. Yeah, 72 and not 70 because I can count. Yes, 72. Uh, just move it over. Not that far. 72, 82, 92, 302. Um, that's one more space. 12. That's 6. That is 6. Um, and then is it 10 more to place the tile? It is. You can't do it any sooner than that. Yeah, it is another 10. So yeah, as you're moving tiles around the boards, it's 10 frames per input. Uh, and then the funny thing after that is we can just hit square again to keep shuffling the board. <laughs> I love that. I just, I just love that. So the question, though, is, is square faster right here... Um, you know what, actually, what if we place the tile later and then hit square? Odd say it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's, that's faster. Uh, is that faster? It's the same. It is just based on frame count. Changing when we place the M did not impact the shuffling of the board. Great. <laughs> Great. <laughs> We can't hit it there, right? That doesn't... Yeah, that is a lag frame. I'm not imagining that. 32 to 46. Um, yep. 46, 50, 52, uh, to 66? Yes, 66. Um, and then we could go over, but what if we shuffle the rack? No! What if we do it here? <sighs> Yet versus... Yes! No! Okay, at this point it is faster to just hit right and... and take it. Seventy-two to eighty-six. Nope, not square. Wait, what happens if we hit square while we're moving tiles? Nothing? It's nothing. Okay, good. You can't also shuffle the rack while you're placing tiles. That's good to know. Uh, so we move it up. Uh, Seventy-two to eighty-six, we place it. 
And again, it's 14, not... Yeah, to 86. Uh, and then... What if we shuffle once? No! Ah, oh, that's so unfortunate. Ever anticipated these types of shenanigans? I hope so. I hope that Brian Shepard is smiling down on us from his chair. I assume he's still alive. I have no reason to think he's dead. <laughs> um, okay, so we need to just take the S. We're not we're not lucking into an STY shuffle. Uh, 92 to 06. Hello, Tobin. You gonna jump up? You gonna jump up and help us, Tass? No. You just go wander around in the room. Okay. You're a good kitty. Uh, and then... Can we shuffle? We can. We can get one more shuffle in. That is just as fast. That doesn't lose time. And in my opinion, doesn't lose time is just as good as optimal. There we go. That's that's the fastest way we can play modest. Hey buddy, you gonna jump or not? There you go. And then when do we get actual input? Kitty, oh my god. There is where we get actual input. We can, yes. We can and I'm about to. Okay, so we have that. Uh, See, so yeah, we should be able to just... That's, that's what it looks like at full speed. That's, that's the fastest it can go. Hello, kitty. Uh, and then it sounds like we're waiting on, um, on a new board. Uh, but that's fine, because I can angle the camera and show you guys a cat. Look at this. Look at this! It's a cat! <clears throat> Awkward. Awkward. Happy kitty. Oh my god, he likes this. He likes this a lot. I haven't had dinner yet, and dinner is going to take a while to make. I want to make chicken parmesan tonight. Uh, I had a really late lunch. I ate lunch at like 4.30. Um, but I wish, I wish I was capable of streaming my cooking, because I would happily just turn this into a cooking stream until the new board is ready. <laughs> Oh, also, here's a neat thing. We can look at the letters that are missing now. Uh, so this one is the E that we played, I assume. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ninth. Yeah, that's this E is taken out. Uh, let's start. Let's start crossing these out. That's something we can do. Um, I guess I'll just take a brush, big, make a a big old bigger than that. Oh my goodness, like forty. Just blot that out. 40 might be a little big. Maybe... Maybe, uh, 30? Yeah. Uh, what else are we missing? The S from Modesty. The Y is still on our rack, right? Right? The T and the M. Uh, that's the D that we just played. This is gonna be an O? Which O is this? Hold on. Those are that's so many good caddy modes. <laughs> excellent, truly excellent. Hello. Those are one of the uh, the best Scrabble content creators. Will Anderson also has cats and cat emotes, and they're very good, very good cats. I just thought you'd be interested to know that. Uh, I assume it's this O, but let me actually count. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven, eight. It is that O. Is that all seven? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 
three, four, five, six, seven. That is all of them. Cool. I am so good at stalling. I'm the best there's ever been. So if we were to keep with the old board and do antonym, accidentally started collecting them when your friends started streaming and she made a bunch, and then you made emotes of your cat, yeah. My most used emote last year was uh, Shemp M. Spin. Um, unfortunately, I finally ended my subscription to Shemp. Uh, because I think I caught one of his streams in the last year. The new board will also use Antonym. Good, I can keep flying off of that then. That helps. So we want Antonym. We have the Y. If we're going to be trying to shuffle tiles anyway, since the Y is going to be at the start of the rack... Do we want to get Antonym in order and just play the Y first? Or do we want to get them in any order and try rack shuffling to uh, to get optimal tile selection? <laughs> That's a good one, Dozer. I'm kind of in favor of getting Antonym in any order and having a second turn of being very goofy with how we shuffle the rack. Dozer wants to see shuffle strats, I kind of agree. Every day I'm shuffling, this cat is so happy, oh my god. Happy kitty boy. Okay, so where... I don't have the, the picture open. Where are we going then for antonym? Starting up here, there's an A right here. Or right here, rather. There's also one right here. I could choose the order based on the shuffle. Oh, God. That... No, I think that would actually be really hard. That's more that's so much more work than i want to put into this if order is determined by total frame count uh that means we would basically want to try every combination of picking letters until we get a shuffle that works and i'm not doing that right now the shuffle memes are really good i get it but that's not happening what happens if I do down right on this frame instead of right? Where does it... That's not where I meant to be. Down right on this frame. It sends me to the wrong spot. What happens if I do down left on the next frame? It still sends me to the wrong spot. Okay, so I want to do right and then down. That's, that's what I actually want. Down puts you there? Excuse me? This dumb game. Why does down not skip a row? That's, that's so dumb, right? <laughs> no, I don't think that's going to be how it works. I... If we pick tiles in a different order, we're going to end up starting our turn on a different frame. So the only way I would feel any confidence that we could do it like that is if we pick tiles and then wait until that frame and then shuffle. God, that would be so funny, though. Okay, we picked our tiles, now we wait for three seconds, and then we hit shuffle and it just ends up in the right order. Yeah, okay, I'm doing that. That sounds really funny. Okay. Okay, so we want antonym. Uh, we already have the O, so we need A-N-T. That's only gonna work if, uh... 
if we can get to the frame at the same time, though. Most of the letters for antonyms seem pretty close to this side of the board. So I think if we need to rearrange the letter, the order that we get them, it might, uh, it might just not work. Okay, I suppose the thing to do for this frame is to do down right and then right. Which I can't just do that, that counts as holding right. Okay, so that's A, we need N, uh, which is in a couple of places. There are multiple N's on this board, who knew? I think I can do down right, down right. Like that. That is the N. We need a T, uh, which means we can go down and then left. Yeah. Oop. We already have the O, we need another N. Another N, we could go far left, we could go up. Up twice. Nope. Like that. And then we need the M for antonym. And there's one there. Is that it? Is that the only M left? Are there only two M's in Scrabble? Never played Scrabble before in my life. Wait. The board also has three M's. In addition to the other issues this board has, magnify modest antonym. Just, uh, just throwing that out there. So we're getting the other M that's still around. Um, and yeah, there's only, there's only one way to get that. So... He did make it extremely fast. I am very impressed by that. I'm not denying how impressive that is. Where does down left send us? It sends us there, really? Weird. Okay, where does left and then down left send us? Where does down put us here? Down puts us there. So if I instead want down left, it just doesn't take the left, really? Okay, so down... Oh my god, no, that's too far. Left, down, left. Sends us there, and then it's just another down. That's an E. I needed one more left. Oop. That's the M for antonym. The other tile we get, we would want to be the M for magnify... Uh, but Magnify is not going to end up in the next board, so I guess... Orange Triangle, do you know what other word is going to go off of Antonym yet? Alternately, what word is going to come off of the S in Modest? Is it still going to be Soprano? Just draw the other M. Duh. God, what if I could just cheat and let the game let me pick tiles I've already played? When are we going to find Ace in Scrabble? It's probably Soprano. Can't make guarantees. I understand. Um, oh kitty, you're so soft. Oh my god. I guess I'll take the O, and we'll just hope it works out. That's, that's the plan right now. So the O, it looks like the nearest O is right here. There's two above the M. There's also one that's over here, there's one that's up here. 
<laughs> work in seven hours? Oh. Uh, so let's go up left, up left, up right, up left, right, up, X. Should you selp? Maybe, maybe. Uh, at least wait until we can figure out if this goofy, goofy idea works. Imagine if it just worked there. Can I shuffle earlier than that? Can I shuffle earlier than that? No. Earliest frame I can shuffle is 3874. Oops. Okay. Um. Hold on, I'm gonna just... Gonna make this a little easier on myself. Going to screenshot that, and then go a few frames, and then screenshot that. Crud. We have two ends. Dustin, I don't know which order I got the ends in. I don't, I don't know, I don't know where the tiles went. <laughs> Put tobacco off of the O in Soprano? Yeah, okay. I think I'll be goofing around with tile shuffling anyway, so... I think I think we got some time. We get to find out, though. So 3874 is the time we need to get to. Um... Oh, wait. No matter what, we need the Y to be in a certain spot. Don't we? We need the Y to be here. Uh, because we can't, we can't put the Y in a different spot. So we need to shuffle a couple of times until we can get the Y there. Just change last tile for a test. What do you mean? Oh, you mean like to see if the shuffle stays the same? God, the Y does not want to end up in that spot. Unfortunate. Yeah, I guess let's, uh, I can, I can try to do some, some goofy stuff here. So the order, how do I want to think about this? The order I want to get the tiles is so that one of the ends is first. Start with an N. I don't know which one. Um, yeah, just let's start with an N. Okay. Oh, but the last letter would be swapped. I am still stalling for time, so I'm just going to do it this way anyway. I think it's just going to be a bunch of down presses. I don't think I can get to an end faster than that one at the bottom. I am not recording. There we go. Uh, there. N. Uh, next letter. Um. Uh, 
Wait, hold on. Am I thinking about this right at all? I'm not thinking about this right. I... My brain is not working. Hold on. Yes, Pepsi, it is in fact a cat. He's very good. He's very happy on me right now. The letter that's going to end up in front... No, the letter in the second place. Right now. Is going to end up at the end. I want to start with an O. That's the goal. Okay. I think I want to do down, right, down, right. Oop. And that gets me the O. Next, the letter in this spot is either staying in this spot or moving to the front. I don't know. I can just hit X right now and it will give me the A and I can hope that that's what I want. This is gonna be so funny. I love this. The next letter, the T, is gonna end up over there, which is where I would want the Y, unfortunately. Um. Wait, is it? A, N, T, N, Y, it is. This is where I would want the Y. Um, but the Y's gonna be at the front. Wait. Right, yeah, we already accepted that this simply isn't gonna work exactly the way we want it to. So I guess instead, the M can go there? So next I want to get an M which I determined is here, here, yes. So that's gonna be down left. Why is that down left? What? There's, this is complete nonsense. Down left, down right, X, that's the M. Next letter. The one that's here, I'm assuming is gonna go in the third spot. That needs to be the T. So where is a T from here? I can go right a few and grab the T. Right two. That'll be a T. Okay, that's the T. Yowie. Um, then's the other... Then is the M, which this is going to go in the second spot. I want that to be the other N I draw. Um, wait, did I miss a letter? Wait a minute. And... God damn it, this is too hard for my brain to think about. A... I'm sorry, Eliza. You're right. You're right. Shouldn't have done that. No, this is the first M that I'm going to draw. That is right. Okay. Perhaps too stupid. Okay. Uh, this is up left, I think? No, because it does that! Why?! <laughs> It went from here to here with a single up left press. It's like it took left and then up and then put me there. I wanted to go here. I, <laughs> this is so silly. Thank you, Pepsi, for contributing to the hydrate challenge. Give me the N and then I want another N, which I can just do with going up. Then go to 3874. It didn't work. It just... It simply didn't work. Oh, wait. No, wait. Did it? It might have. 
It totally worked. I just got the ends mixed up. I did have it right. I just... The letter in the third spot stays in the third spot. That's all that was wrong. I also probably just messed up. When am I going to re-enable the game redemption reward? I genuinely don't know. Wait, is this right? Where... What did the board look like a second ago? Hold on. Two ends at the end went to... Yeah, no, I think this worked. The M went from four to five. The Y went from first to fifth, or to sixth, rather. Uh, yeah, no, this totally works. I just need to swap when I get the ends. Play the word nine? No, I can't. I'm so sorry. I would if I could. I really would if I could. It's, because the N's were the last letters I got. That makes it even... No, that's not right. I need to redo, like, this whole thing. <laughs> Crud. Okay, that's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. It's fine. My foot is completely asleep, Topin. This is getting kind of painful, actually. You sweet cat. You sweet, sweet kitty face. I really want to push him off of me so that my foot can feel normal again, but... But alas. Okay. The second letter... What did I, what did I do before? I got the O first. That is correct. I do want to get the O first. After that, I want to get an N. Everything after that first one is going to be different. So it's O, and then N. Yeah, I, I'm going to be sure to save this stream, too. I want this stream to exist so that people can look at it and get frame counts from stuff if they want it. I sound different? I'm not sure why. <clears throat> Sneak by to chew on your cables. Classic kitties. Classic kitties. Toe bean means my toe being asleep. Silly, silly kitty. Have a good night, Dustin. Kitty, where are you going? You gonna you gonna jump down? Did you learn? Did you learn that I want my foot back? Are you gonna go or not? Are you just standing up? You're not getting on my desk, that's for sure. Oh my god. You're so cute. Okay, he's not going. So we got the O. Next, we need an N. Where are we? We are here. Uh, where does downright put us? Are you going or not, Topin? <laughs> Make up your mind, please. Well? Nope. Okay. Where does downright put us? Uh, it puts us nowhere if we press it too soon. That is the right spot. Perfect. So that's the N. Um, I probably should have, like, taken notes of what all of the other letters I got were, because <laughs> I don't remember anymore. Next letter is gonna end up there. That's what I would want to be the Y. Instead, it's gonna be the M. Uh, so I think I want down left. Yes, and then left. That's the M. After M is the other N. This is going to go up to the front, so that's going to be an A I want. Which I can do with two ups. And then the M is going to go there. That's the other N. 
from here. I got that one before. Is that still... Maybe. <clears throat> I think I want to do... Down left... left down x and then the o ends up there and i want that to be the t the t wait oh gosh dustin and pepsi well done big level from pepsi yo chloe it is a kitty. He's been very sweet. He's helping. I messed up. I absolutely messed up. Because I'm a bozo. I don't know if y'all knew this, but I'm a complete bozo. <laughs> Fun fact about me. I have strong bozo lineage in my family. I'm supposed to get a T here, not an N. Where's the T? Where is it? It's over there. This should not be that hard for me to figure out. I don't know why I'm having so much trouble with this. Uh, down right is actually fine here again. Uh, but then it's gonna be... No, no, no analog inputs. We don't need the analog. And it's gonna be just down, I think. And then X for the T. Yes. For the fourth letter gonna go there. This is where we want the M. That's still the case. Yes. Yes? Yes. M. We're gonna go, gonna go left a bunch. Then that's it? X? That is the M. Good. Then the A, which, same things as before, actually, it's up, up, up. Nope, nope, just two ups. Okay. M ends up there. This is where we want the other N, uh, which is going to be this one. Still end on two Ns? Yes, we do end on two ends. Um, is it just down? It is down. Let's go. And then up, I believe. And then go to 3874. There we go. It worked. It actually worked. I haven't golf. I think that's done. Um, then up, and then it's 78 to 94. Um, and I'm putting it, where am I putting it? I, I had some ideas for what I wanted to do uh, to cap it off, but it was looking like it was going to take a lot of work, and it was kind of looking like it was going to take a lot of work for something that was starting to just annoy some people anyway, so... So I gave up. Oh wait, no, I don't need a left input, that's totally right, just X. And then... 38. Uh, and up, and 56? 54? 56. 54? Did I wait too long on the other letter? Crud, hold on. 
78 to... I did wait too long on the other letter. It's supposed to be 92. Oh, it didn't matter. It didn't matter because I caught a lag frame anyway. Hilarious. So it's 32 to 46. Nope. It didn't take that. Wait. Wait, why didn't it take that? Wait, wait. <laughs> Oh, I didn't wait for the movement, that's why. Sorry. Yeah, it's supposed to be 34. I hit X. Uh, and then I wait four frames, and then hit X and up. And down left at 54. Not 52, 54. Uh, and then at 64, hit X again. And then at that point, I should be able to just start doing a whole bunch of... Uh, Pretty quick movements. 70 to 84. 80. I'm too high. I'm too high! Actually, I can probably just get away with that, can't I? Because the rest of that is the same. Oops. Uh, 90 to... 04? Yep. And then 04 to 14, hit X. And then luckily, because these are just one off, I can just do right and X, and I don't actually lose any time for that. 20 to 34, uh, 38, 40 to 54, X, right, X. Bah! And then, we shouldn't need to do that anymore. I think for the rest of the game, we should be able to set it up so that the letters are just in the right order anyway. Uh, that said, what is the first input I have here? Not there. I don't know, 14? Faster than, or later than 14. 22? Still later? Not gonna be that late. 26, maybe? 26 works, what about 24? 24 also works, but 22 I tried? 24 is the answer. Okay, we're making progress. Let me blot out the uh, the letters I got. So I need to do that. Uh, so let's see, we got the O and the A here. Not naming my keyframes? I, not all of them. For the most part, as I do this, the only ones that matter are the latest ones. I got M. I got this N. I got this T. I got this N. And I think that's it. Yeah, that's right. Okay. So we need the letters for soprano. <clears throat> we have the O. We need to start with a P. Which is going to be one down there. Okay, so... Oops. Down. Down. Yeah, down. Um, down right? No, just down again. Gosh, is there a way I could make this faster? No, there, there's not. I would need to press down every time anyway. It doesn't matter. Down right there. Actually, I could probably do right down, can't I? 
just for the fun of it. An X, so that's the P. And then I need an R, which is directly up, which, can I do up left? Almost, I can do up left and then right. So dumb, so dumb. And then I need an A, which again, I might be able to get away with just doing up left. I can, that's perfect. And then I need another N for soprano. Uh, where's the next N? It's gonna be in the second row, it looks like. Pretty far... Oh, no, wait, there's one right there. No, I can do down left. And then down. Golf, if you can, I would actually really appreciate that. The thing is, it doesn't seem consistent with... Like, if it was just a question of if it prioritized certain directions over others. Like, if down left was always down, then left. But I don't think it is always that way. I think... I think it's like down is over... prioritized over left. But also, left is prioritized over up. It's not just horizontal or over vertical. I think. I think. If I were to hit... Well, I guess the other problem is, like, right here. If I go up, it's either going to send me left or right. Do you know... How do we figure out which one it'll always do? Is that consistent? Does it send us to the closest one? Does it always send us left? Does it always send us right? What about when we go down? Yeah, it... It's weird. I wish it would just skip the row. I wish just up from here sends you here, but... No. Anyway, that's the N. We need another O for Soprano. There's gonna be one at the top. I also would have hoped that it would skip rows. There's an O at the top. There's also... There's also one over there. Is that much further? Um... Well, here, I... Sends us there. So I think we can hit right and then right again. Yeah, horizontal does skip columns for sure. Um, is that it? That's a W. One more. Is that faster than trying to get the O at the top? It shouldn't matter. I shouldn't be thinking about this. And then I think... Orange Triangle said go for... What was it? T for tobacco? Tobacco off the O and Soprano. Okay. So we want a T after this point. Which, if we're here... Oh, this is definitely faster, never mind. This is definitely faster, absolutely, than going to the top for an O, because we can then just get a T right there. And then, as always, when do we get to move? Board appears there. There we go, that's first. That is first input. Up, 96 to 00, down left, wait 10 frames. Another lag frame, that's unfortunate. Hit X. Um, 28 to... Oh gosh, that's right, we do need to do another down left. Uh, to 42, I guess? Yeah. And then 42 to 52, hit X. And then wait a few frames up, 58 to 72, um, X. 
that's too far. 78 to 92 x 98 to 12 um, yeah that gets us on the O 18 to 32 and then right and then X and that's the turn see what I mean like once we start going this actually goes really fast that was a very short turn I need to find another album to put on, though, because all of me ended. Actually, you know what? I haven't listened to this John Coltrane album in a while. I'm good with this. Are we still doing zigzags? Um, zigzagging only is only fast if you're moving more than two tiles in a... I mean, it's not fast, sorry. Zigzagging is only not slow if you're moving more than two tiles in a straight line. If, uh, like in this case... You know, where we did a down left, and then a down left, and then everything just goes in a straight line. We couldn't use it. And for antonym, uh, we only had one left input, and then it was all diagonals anyway. Uh, for tobacco, I'm starting it here with, what is that, T... How do you spell tobacco? Updated board, let me see. Tobacco, okay, that is how to spell tobacco. Hold on. Let me... No, oh, goddammit. There we go. Yeah, sorry, Golf. It's not going to be fast here, either. Please verify all words are valid. Yeah, I can check it in Zizava again. Ooh, heinous. Neat word. Jukebox I already checked, I know that one. Wealthy, checked those. Festive, eggnog, fattier, radial, inertia, I know. Squeeze, of course. Uh, dwarves, yes. Airflow, that's a neat one. Unaired is in there. Dipolar. Yep, these are all in there. Yeah, Dipolar's a neat one. Uh, yeah, yeah, they're all in here. I will continue running with this. <laughs> yes, that's actually very true. Festive and Eggnog. Very good to put in here. Um, yeah, let's, uh, where, where do we get to input again? 96? Too early. 98? Too early. 5400? Too early. 02? There it is. Okay. Your computer crashed just after you got the solution. Oh, no. Well, thank you. Again, that was very fast. As much as it may feel like I was stalling for a while, that's so much faster than I could have possibly put together a board like this. What tiles did I already draw? I need to blot out some more spots. Hold on. I took that A, I took that N and P and R and O and T. Is that it? I think that's it. Yeah. Yeah, that's all I took last time. Okay. So we have the T for tobacco. So we need another O, which is right near the top, luckily. It's 
the O. We need a B for tobacco. And the parcel solution. The program completes it. That's awesome. Uh, where is the B? There, is there? They're both at the end. That's fine. That's actually fine. I can do some down presses and get over to it. I know that. I know that that's how that works. Also, are the blanks A's again? Just so I know. Um, okay, so it's down, down. And that sends me to the end, and so it's down and then up. That does work. And then that's the B. And then an A from over here. So you just make them A's. Gotcha. Cool, cool, cool. I could use one of them right now if I wanted. It is the closest to this B. Uh, what am I getting after this, though? Some C's? Where are the C's on this? There's one there. Oh, there's one all the way over there. I guess I'll use a blank for this, yeah. Wait, where does it put the cursor? There. Uh, yeah, that's fine, actually. Up left? What does that do? That does put me there. Okay. Up left, and then left, and then left, and then X for the blank. And then down left. Um, they're not... It's not that bad. It's not any worse than anything else is going to end up being. I Again, I, I'm really not trying to optimize this part of the task. My goal is to optimize the playing, not the letter picking. If I was trying to optimize this, I probably wouldn't be doing it on stream. I'm fine with getting inputs on the first frame, but everything else would just take longer to think about than I want to. On stream, at least. So that's a, that's the J. I wasn't supposed to go that far left. Tabajo. Uh, and then up left. And then... I guess up left again and a bunch of lefts? And unfortunately, I cannot just alternate down left, up left, like I would love to. That's such a shame. It's also such a shame that uh, analog inputs aren't... aren't active here. I'm kind of surprised about that, actually. When was, When did this game come out? Hold on. It must have been the 98... Dictionary. It says analog controller compatible. What the heck? It it has to. There has to be something I'm doing wrong. There's no way it doesn't take analog inputs at all. Is this is this my fault? Also, real quick, I should save. I really need to save this. It has gone too long without me saving, and that's a really bad idea for Task Studio. It's trying, it's trying, there we go, okay. Uh, okay, so... Config controllers... Nope, not what I meant to be doing. Yeah, okay, those are all set up right. But, like, analog controls. I mean, no, it's getting the inputs here. It's not like Task Studio isn't picking up the inputs. It is. So, what the heck? You know what? This is silly. Sorry, I can extremely easily figure out if this is an emulator problem. I can turn on my PlayStation, put in Scrabble, and figure out if I can control it with an analog stick. so hard to do this with a kitty sitting on me. 
No! Ah! Oh my god. Sorry, my USB extender hub falls over when I try to do anything with it. Scrabble is booting up. If only I just had a second controller with an analog stick nearby. I'm sure I have them around, but... Okay, can I control this with an analog? That's fine, Scrabble, I don't care. There we go. I can! What the heck? Okay, so this is some kind of emulator problem. start over with this knowledge. What might be wrong if it's picking up the inputs here, but not... Do I need to hit the mode button? Do I actually need to hit the mode button? Yes, I needed to hit the mode button. I... oh, oh my god. So mad. Okay. We learn things. We learn things. Tobin, buddy... I think you might have to get down, kitty. You're sliding all over my lap. I don't know that this is working well. How are you doing? Are you okay? No, maybe you're fine. <sighs> okay. So... So... Let's go back a little bit. Because I have some questions now. Let's just hit mode real quick here so it's on. So we go up left. Out of curiosity, what does up left do? Oh, that's that up left, sorry. It's not... what? 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 I'm so confused by this. It is taking them eventually. Was I... Maybe I was hitting it too soon. Let's just give it a few frames here. And then... Just like, just start holding input. So yeah, eventually it goes. But not if I just tap? Do I need to be holding analog input? What is wrong with this? Here I can, hold on, let me adjust the camera. There we go. Cat is gone, back to streamer. If I don't figure this out relatively quickly, I'm going to finish this task without analog inputs, and it can be an improvement for a future task. Because as of right now, this doesn't make any sense. So, that works if I hold it for a bit, but not if I tap it. So let's, let's be clear.
Oh my god, this is horrible. I'm not going to work with this. I'm sorry. I'm sorry that it's not going to be as perfect as we might like. This is something to figure out at a later time. I don't know the pattern for when it's going to pick up these inputs. And this should theoretically only save time on these menus that I said I didn't want to optimize anyway. So I'm just not going to worry about it. We are here. We hit up left. We hit up left again. We do a bunch of left inputs. How, how many left inputs? We need to go two... Three more. Right? Yeah, one more. It's the other C. It ends on an O. Where are we? What can we pick up next? Either a J or an H or a W is our options. J, H, W... H is pretty close. What does up left put me? That was left and then up. You were right, Golf. That is horizontal and then vertical. I wouldn't be that bothered that it moved me there, but that's just really funny to me. Because I looked at this and said, I'm right here. H is closest. H is right up here. I'll take the H. So I hit up left, and you know where it put me? It put me on the W that I could also use. <laughs> this game. I could probably do a frame count also from last input to next turn, but eh, who knows if that's consistent. It does not take long to, uh, to figure that out myself. X up to 14, uh, where we start holding down left. No? What? I'm sorry, was that not the first input? No, it wasn't. I... More bozo. It was 7... 5700. Okay. X up, uh, and then to 16, where I start hitting down left. 16, 26, 36, 46, 56, 66? Yeah, I guess 66, and then 76 I do left, and then on 86 I hit X? Yeah. Always go left or always go right? Yeah. Yeah, we'll have to look at it next time. Um... Yep, up. Uh, 92 to 06. And then at 10, and... Hello. At 10, then at 12, at 16... Or at 26, rather. At 30, at 32, at 46... Oh, wait a minute. Uh, yeah, 46 and then 50 because it's an A. I assume we can't... Yeah, no, 48 wouldn't make any sense there. That, that doesn't work. Real quick, just to check. You can do left and right inputs there. So, to be clear, Z and B are equally as fast for blank tiles as an A. That is good to know. You can you can buffer that input and get it in before you could select A anyway. Wait, wait, no, there's another thing I need to check. Can any other inputs uh No, no other inputs. Okay. I wanted to check, can any other inputs select that? Uh, because if they could, then uh, A would still be fastest. But they're not, so we're fine. <clears throat> okay, and then the two Cs. 
I can't do anything else here, can I? Like, no, I, I can't. I can't. If there's any other way to select that faster, but no, alas. 56, 270. 74, 76, 290. And then uh, the right press, X. Tobacco. Good. <clears throat> Need to blot out some more tiles, and we have the W for wealthy. Uh, and I also need to figure out when we get input. Oh yeah, with the double, the double word. Uh, 28, maybe? 28 works, what about 26? 26 does not. Um... Remind me... I can do it now, actually. This is dumb. I'm sorry. Hold on. Uh, I want to know how long the double word takes. From, I guess, starting to look at the last tile to getting input on the next screen. Sixty-two ninety-five to sixty-four twenty-eight is when I got input again. Right. Uh, so on the next turn, when I play wealthy. Uh, when I play Wealthy, I want to check how long it takes from the marker going to the Y to, uh, to having control again. Golf, I think what I'm going to guess is most of the inputs that I'm tracking are when I, or most of the frames that I'm tracking are when I have input. But the ones that keep ending up on an odd number are when... Hey, don't chew on my cables, kitty. Get out of here. The ones that keep ending up on an odd number are when visuals update. So I'm guessing there's a visual update frame and then an a uh, inputs update frame. And that's that's why. Like, I wouldn't be surprised if the frame that this screen actually appears is on an odd number. 31. Yeah. Yeah. Come here. Come here, little bean. You stop chewing on my cables. You stop it. Oh, you mean that. Um, I see what you mean. Okay, no, I thought you were talking about something different. I missed that line. Yeah, those are lag frames. Um... Every game seems to have them. I don't really know details about why I'm not I'm not so involved with console architecture that I could answer that Kitty oh my god you're so cute you're so cute God damn it I need to work on this kitty I need to work on this but you're so cute you're cute and distracting What tiles did I take last time? I got the W. I got uh, the B over here. I got the blank. I got this C. I got the other C. I got something, didn't I? I thought I was a game dev. You thought. I am, but it doesn't matter. I got that O. Oh, kitty. Every detail about every game and all the emulators? That's a good question. That is a good question, Golf. He's a cat dad. Hello. Hello, little one. Is that all the letters? I don't feel like I blotted out seven spots. Hmm. 
Yeah, no, I mean, I guess I'm... I guess I'm on the right count. I must have. Okay, so if I'm doing wealthy now... Yeah? Are you gonna bite my hand, you silly thing? Oh, I'm already on an E. That's perfect. Why are you... What are you doing? She is trying to bite my hand. Why? What are you doing? God, she's so cute. Welcome back, Manly. Happy birthday again. Happy birthday. You get to watch Scrabble. Okay. Um, so, ideally golf right here. What? What? What are you doing? I wish she would just lay down. <laughs> I That's the ideal situation here. She just lays down so I can keep working. But she's kind of occupying one of my hands at the moment. There we go. Okay. Okay. Back to this. Uh, we can hit X here and take... We're not recording. There we go. We can hit X here and take that E. If I hit down from here, it sends me to the right. So golf, keep that in mind. Down, just a vertical down sent me to the right. So if I were to hit down left, will that send me all the way to the left? It does. And if I hit down right, does that send me one further? It does. Oh, but that would be left down and right down, not down then whatever. So that I, that makes sense anyway. Anyway, that's the A for wealthy. Um, is this what I want actually? Yeah, it totally is. Ho oh, <laughs> you know what? I can do that, and I can hit X, and then I can hit left, and then I can hit X, and I have the L for wealthy. <laughs> and then I need T-H-Y? Oh, wait a minute, no, I'm playing through something. Which letter do I already have? I, yeah, no, I wasn't thinking. I don't have the board up, even. I already have the A, I don't need the A. Uh, so it's down left is what I want, and then X for the L. Um, hold on a second, I need to answer a text. I'll get to that in a second, golf. Sorry, I've been getting a number of texts tonight. Most of them do not matter, but this one kind of does. Um, that's true, Golf. It might. Yeah, you know what? This is silly. We have this frame. Let's just play around a bit and check. So if I hit right, right, down, that sends me to the right. If I hit left and down, that still sends me to the right. It looks like down is always sending me to the right. And up is always sending me... I'm sorry, that skips column? Or skips row? <laughs> so it tries to send you left on up. But if, uh, if there is nothing left, then it skips row. That's so dumb. That's so dumb. It seems like down is always going to send you right. Up is always going to send you left. But, uh, yeah. No, we get it. I don't need to keep covering it. That's so silly. Okay. Um, where are we? We have... Where are we? Uh, we have the 
L was the last thing we got. Yeah. Okay. How does one move from one cluster to the other? That's a good question. I assume it'll just move you automatically. I assume, yeah, it'll keep going up, and then if it... If there's nothing up and left, it'll try going up and right. That's my assumption. We'll find out when we get closer to the end, I guess. When we have more, more blank spots on the board. We have an L. We need the T. Uh, for wealthy. Where is T? There's an H here. Which, actually, I might just take that. Because having one letter out of order is not slow. And it's nearby, so I think I'm just going to take this H next. Uh, so that's, what, upright? And then to the right. And then X. And then not an analog input X. Nope, not what I wanted. Oh my god. Uh, and that gets me the H. Where is the T? Ho ho! Perfect! You know where the T is? I press up, and that's where the T is. No, it's... Oh, I forgot. That's the wrong direction. Never mind. It would be a bunch of down presses. Rats, how do we get to the other end quickly? Is it a bunch of down presses, then? Is there a T that's closer? I see three T's left on the, uh... Left on the thing, and they're all over on the right side, so I think we're just gonna have to deal. Just go down a bunch. Oops. Uh, and then left one time, and that's a T. And then we need a Y for wealthy. And the Y is smack in the middle. And yeah, that is the only other Y. Okay. Up left. Um, I guess up left again. And then a bunch of left. H on the way from the T to the Y? Maybe? I think it'd be about the same. And I'm happy to have more blank spots on the top row for quickly traversing that later. And it's gonna be this spot. Uh, yeah, no, the other H is right here. It is... It is very close to... It's, there's a T here, and a T here, and a T here. So yeah, the H is basically on the way, but it, it doesn't matter much. Uh, so that's the letters for wealthy. Oh, I could grab the other H for heinous right now, actually. What else would I want? There's heinous, there's jukebox. I am pretty close to the... No, I should get the J for jukebox, actually. Never mind. But uh, that feels pretty, pretty definitely closest. Unless I want the F for festive, which is also close, but J is closer. They're the same. They're the same distance. I'm going to take the J. Um, nope. Still no. There it is. What about 28? 30 is the correct frame. Okay. Um, and we're already on the W. We want X. X. Nope, don't touch that. Stop. Oh my god. X. Up. Uh, 32 to 46. Start hitting down left. And it's gonna be... 3 down left, 1 down. So 46, 56, 66, 76. 
86 hit X. Oh, kitty. She's so soft. Uh, 90, 92, 06. Uh, 10, 12, uh, 26, hit left, 36, hit X. And then right and X to get the 8, or the T. And then uh, up, 42, so 56 for X. Then 60 then 62, then 64. Wait, no. Oh my god. 76. This is not hard. I don't know why this keeps throwing me. 80, 82, 96. Challenging a, a Tass's play. <laughs> uh, and then right, and then X, and we're good. I am manly. The kittens have been insistent. Tobin was on my lap for a while. Now Princess is. I don't, I don't really have a say in it. Oh, I wanted to check this. I remembered. I didn't forget. Uh, this is 01. 7301. Who, when do we get control? 46. No, way too early. What about 56? Still way too early. What about 64? Still too early. What about 66? There it is. 73, 66. Okay. So, a little more calculator. 7, 7, 366 minus 7301 is 65 frames. I did not need a calculator to figure that out. Uh, the other one is 6428 minus 6295 is 133 frames. That is the same. That is the same, right? 68? 68? No. 78? 68. It is 68. Interesting. The bingo animation takes 66 frames. The double word animation takes 68 frames. No, that's not right. That's not right at all. Wait, what? No, something else is going on here. These are different amounts of times as before. What the heck? Okay, here's what's confusing me. It might be lag frames, but it would need to be a lot of lag frames to to answer the thing that I'm confused about. Um, when I checked before, the time it took uh, from the marker going to the last tile to gaining control in the tile selection was 133 frames. This time, the time it's taking this marker to get to the Y, right? That's what I checked, and that was 7301? It is. To gain and control on the screen, it's only 66 frames. It's taking like half as long. It was a bingo here too. That's why, never mind. That was because it was the first turn. That's what's throwing me. Never mind. Or not a bingo, it was a double word here on the first turn. That's what was throwing me off. Never mind, everything makes sense.
We're fine. Um, hold on, let me just add a note to this frame count. Okay. Uh, and yes, to answer the question for why it's 68 instead of 66, I agree it's probably lag frames. I'm, I'm not too concerned about that. So it appears to be 1.1 seconds for both of them. Okay, next up. Next up, I need to blot out tiles again. What did I collect? I got the E. I got this L. I got the Y and the J. I got this T. Imagine you're at a bus stop. Also, hey, Five Crab. I, I don't think I said... I don't think I said that. Oh, also the cat left. I can move the camera again. Maybe you guys like just seeing the N++ shirt, but... Um, should I put on a Miles Davis album or a Thelonious Monk album? Chat's choice. Miles Davis or Thelonious Monk? Thelonious Monk. Sounds good. This is Thelonious Monk live in Paris, 1964. Uh, okay. Did I get anything else, or was that it? I surely got something else. I got... That's five blanks there, that's right. I got something up here. I got the H. That's the other thing. Yo, horns! Also, this is loud in my ears. Was that it? Three blanks. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's all I got. Rubes, or burse, or super. It was resub, right? Thank you, horns, for the the six month streak, the seven months of subbing. Much appreciated. <laughs> okay, I think I got all the letters I got. Um, scenario. I, there's one SNL sketch where Keenan Thompson says the word scenario that way, and every time I think of the word scenario, I just picture that. And I think scenario is the only word there. I don't think there's, there's any more. At least there aren't in this dictionary. I saw the words actual currency in all caps and thought I was getting another, another alphagram. So I have the J for jukebox. Um, U is over there. Is the K closer? I gotta think about that now. Now that I can, I can I can get letters slightly out of order. Where's the Where is the K? Oh, it's down there. Okay. Horns, I'm not gonna be able to keep up with chat this fast. Hold on. I, yeah, chat is already moving faster than I can keep up. I need to look at this. Um, one, two, three, four, five, or versus four. Yeah, I think it's faster for me to get the K, actually. <clears throat> so, 76 is where we are. It's down. Yes, down, and then down... Um, and then down, and that's the K. 
Uh, and then I definitely need the U. I can't skip it now. Do I? Actually, hold on. Play the J. Yes, I definitely need the U next. It's that after I get U, I can choose between E or B. But I need, I need the U next, definitely. Does drawing order matter? The order I draw them in is the order they end up on the rack. Um, so I, a little bit. It does a little bit. If we want to play it as fast as possible, yes. I'm not worrying too much about optimizing this part. I'm really trying to focus on just following the, the map that Orange Triangle gave me, but... Where is the closest U? There are several U's. I think it's going to be that one. So I need up. Uh, there is a slight delay. It's, um, I'll show you when I'm playing a tile next turn. Wait, grabbing? Oh no, it's just there. Never mind. So I want to go... Where does upright put me here? If I'm correct, it's going to send me right, and then up, and then there. So from here, upright will just send me up. Yes. That's very silly. Uh, and then up, and then... Actually... Hold on. I can think through this a little bit more, can't I? Can I take advantage of these big spaces in the board? That's what I'm thinking about. Because one of the U's is right here. The one I'm currently going for is here, which is pretty close. It's just, you know, up a few times. Um, but if I were to go right, down, right, it would need to be five spaces instead of just four. So yeah, this is the fastest one from here. Unfortunately. Okay, uh, so that's up, up, upright? No, not upright. I did too many. It's upright from there, and that gets me on the, the U. Okay, uh, next is either E or B, one of those. Um, this U is closer to the E's. And the B is over there. Where is X? X is over there? Oh, gosh. Um, that's okay, actually. That's not... That's not ultimately very far. Is that U better? No, that U is better in the end. Okay, hold on. Go back, go back. Uh, we go right down right, and that sends me there, and then it needs to be up, uh, and then left, and then left. Maybe that was the same in the end, because of the, the fact that I could do this input between those. It doesn't matter. We got the U, um, and then we need to go upright a bunch of times. And then right a few times. No, I'm not worried about that. We can optimize this task on our own time later. This this is a theory task. I'm calling it a theory task. It's not perfect. I have no expectation that it will be perfect. Oh, wait, I forgot about the E. Oh, it doesn't matter, because this is an E. Perfect. <laughs> um... So I would go... Hold on, let me make sure I'm not shooting myself in the foot here. Yes, this is still fine. Um, it, 
It does, but that doesn't matter. I can play the E without losing time. Uh, the thing I'm losing time on, though, is this grid. I actually want to do the B first. Or the E first, rather. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm going back. From here, go down, uh, right, down? Yeah, and then just a couple more rights. It's fine, it's fine. And then X, there? No? What, wait, what did I do? I messed up. There. Nope. One more right. Oh my god. I'm... Ah. Uh, there we go. That's what I wanted. Then... Up right? Does that even work? That just sends you up, right? Yeah, it would. Um, so that can actually just be up and then right. And then up and then right. Perfect. And then up again and then X. For the same board to look at selection opposite. It, yeah. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I have the image of the, uh, you know, the letters that we rolled here. Like, if you guys want to look at that separately, you are welcome to. <laughs> it sends you down to the bottom anyway? Why? Why would it do that? I'm so mad. I'm so mad at this game right now. Okay, we're just gonna go up a bunch then. That was a lag frame. Uh, and then one more. And that's gonna send me there, and then I hit down, and then right. And that's the X. And then I need one more letter. And I can start heinous, I can start festive, and that's it. What is closest? The H is really far away. No, it's not. I could have gotten... Oh, what would be better here? Sorry, the fact that I can get the H before... I can get H before X, and that's fine. That's not losing me time. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I'm just gonna hit down. I'm gonna hit down and take the F. Um, yeah, right there. Yeah, I can do that. Give me a second. Yeah, I mean, that's part of this, is, like, ideally, if we're thinking about what is optimal for a task, we would be rolling random racks that are correct anyway. Um, so I'm just, I'm not that worried about it. But it also will take two seconds for me to do that. Oh, really? 70? My first guess was right. 72 is the first frame of, of input. Oh my god, why is almost everybody offline in the Scrabble Discord? <laughs> That's funny. Three online, 18 offline? I mean, I know I'm marked as offline all the time anyway. Um... Okay, there you go. There's the, the tiles I'm working with. If you want to try to... to optimize that. Tobin, you're back. Are you gonna jump on me again? Where? Jump. You're just looking at me. Do you just want me to pay attention to you? Okay.
He's wandering around. I can tell he wants to jump on me. Buddy, make up your mind. Please make up your mind. Tobin, come on. Yeah, come on. Up. Nope. Wandering off again. Okay. 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 We're playing Jukebox. Where's the board? There's the board. <clears throat> oh, crud, you're right. Okay, no, yeah, hold on. I can do that, too. Because it is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven? One of those was the Y? It was, okay, yes. There we go. There you go. That's, uh, that's it. Tobin, stop smacking at my toes. Oh my god. Come here. Stop smacking at my toes! You have sharp claws! Oh my god. Okay, okay. Back to this. I'm playing Jukebox. I need to... Oh, we can do diagonal movement again. Yay. Just for the fun of it. <laughs> good one, Golf. Very good. Okay. So, to answer your questions about how fast things move, Five Crab. Uh, when you're at this point in the game, basically everything's going at 30 FPS. So... Uh, I can hit X to select the first tile on my rack. Is that really the first frame I can do that? That can't be right. No, I was totally wrong. Yeah, okay, I thought so. Okay, I can do that. On the next frame, I can hit up to move it onto the board. After that, I need to wait 14 frames before I can move it. That's nearly a quarter of a second. If I try to, like, start holding left any sooner, nothing happens. So 14 frames, so we need to go to 86. Uh, diagonal movement and horizontal movement is actually the same. So I'm going to go diagonal for fun. When you're moving the tiles around, it's 10 frames before you can do the next input. And we sometimes get lag frames like this. If I try to do a down left there, it doesn't take it. And it also only takes inputs every other frame, so if I try doing it on the frame after, that also doesn't work. It needs to be the next 30 FPS frame. So 8, 18... Am I...? Yeah, I'm fine. Uh, 28 for down left, and then 38 for moving into place, and then 48, we press X to place it. That is a square. We press X to place it. Now... The reason that it doesn't matter that I took the K next is normally to pick the next tile, we've hit X to place a tile. If we tried hitting X again, the game would register that as we are holding X. So we need to wait another frame anyway before we can pick a tile. And in that frame, we can hit right once to select the U instead. That's 54 to 68. Uh, we press down left and then on 78, we can press X. 82, we pick up the K, 84 to 98, um, and then a 2, 4 to 18, 22 uh, to 24 to 38, uh, to 42 to 44, to 58, we press down, and on 68, we do X, then right, then X, and that's the turn. Also, real quick, see if, uh, if we're right here. 73 plus 66 frames is 39. 
is when we have input again. No, that's not right. No, because I said two more? No, that's not right either. Wait a minute. What? Oh, I'm sorry. No. How many frames is it? 65. Sorry, I'm, yeah, I'm on the wrong parity of hitting things. Uh, so instead of 39, it'd be 36? 38? Can I do math at all? There we go, there it is, 38. Okay, what tiles did I pick this time? We are now missing the X, the U, the B, um, the K that I got. Where was that? Is this one? It was this one. What else? The F that we took for festive, I suppose. It was the F for festive, right? That was my plan. Yeah, it was. What else? That E, that's the one we got. <clears throat> Everything else appears to be... We got that. Wait. No, that's right, that's right. I'm, I'm seeing things. It's fine. We're fine. Yes, I think that's all the letters we took. Festive. Uh, we have the F. There's an E right here that I can take immediately. Where's the nearest S? All of the S's are on the other side. That's actually fine if I take the E, because I'm going to be moving down to get over there anyway. So let's do down. That's not the right frame. Let's do down, and then X, and then down, and then down, and then... That's not what I thought was going to happen. I forgot how this worked. Sorry, it's down, and then... Down. And then left a couple times. A couple times? No, not even. I... Well, I'm gonna have to get that E eventually. No, I'm gonna save that E. Yeah, I'm gonna just do down a couple times. Um... Way over there. Yeah. Hit the E, jump over there, hit left, hit X again for the S. Uh, there's a T right here that I will do up and left for, or right rather. It's the T. There's eyes right here too. <laughs> um, wait a minute. Faster? No, that's not that's not fast. If I take this letter, where does it put me? Over there. Oh, yeah, I'm already on it. Okay, never mind. Uh, and then either a V or I don't need the T. Oh my god, I did it again. Sorry. Uh, I don't need the T. I don't need it. We already get a T. We're playing through a T. That's the I, and then I need V or E. Oops, he did in fact do it one more time. Hold on. Oh gosh. I need to redo this whole menu. Uh, the first thing I want to do is hit X. That gives me a V, and I think that's fine. I think it's fine if I just take the V right now. Because I can play around it for every turn as long as the rest of the word is in order. Then I press down a bunch of times. Uh, 
uh, X, yeah, yeah. And then down and left and X, and then X again, and that's the I, and then I need an E, uh, which I can get by pressing left again. That's a W. I can get by pressing left two times. There we go. And then I need to figure out what word I want to start next. I need either H for heinous, A for fattier, or G for eggnog. And I'm on the W, H, A, or G. There's an A close. The H is not close. The G is further than the A by quite a bit. Well, not by that much, I guess. Where's the... There's the other G. Okay. I think A and we do fattier next is the play. Um, I could also play around a lot. That's, that's entirely true as well. I'm gonna... I'm gonna take the A, though. Up. Wait. Yes, that is right. Uh, it sends me there. Up and... Yeah, right and up. And that gives me the A. O eight is when I can start. Okay. X, uh, up on four. 24, I hit down right, and that's uh, 34, I hit X. And then it's right and X and up, uh, 40 to 54, down left, and then on 64, X, right, X, oh, another lag frame, X, up. It'd be nice if we could predict the lag frames somehow, because those impact how optimal it is to play around letters like this. Yep, I already used one of them for that. The other blank is pretty far out of the way from everything I've collected, so... Has not come up yet. Uh, 72 to 86, I hit X. Uh, right, X, up. On... 06, I hit down. On 16, I hit X. And then 4 frames, X, up. 22 to 36. Uh, 40, 42, right, yeah, and then 56. Five crap leveled up! Woo! And I was not paying attention to uh, when I could get input again. Good. 26. And I'm once again going to save the game. So I decided on fattier. So I'm there, I already have the A, uh, I'm playing through the F, so I don't need an F, so I just need T's, which are both on the right side. There's only two T's left? Yeah, there's two T's left and they're both on the right side, okay. Um, and it's two T's in a row, so I do need one of them, I can't, I can't skip it. Connect four tasks when? That's a good question. Um, what is the fastest way over there? Is it going to be down presses again? It is going to be some down presses. See, this is why I like that I've gotten so much on the left side, is it's suddenly pretty fast for me to just move over. Um, I think 
down right is actually what I want, right and then down. And then down again will send me there. Yeah. Yeah, down again, uh, then up, then right, and then right one more time. That's the first T. The second T is up at the top, but I can also get an I, but there's an I right next to that T. But also this is an I, but I don't want to take this because that'll send me to the middle of the board. So I'm going to go up, um, and then I guess up right? Does it matter? I don't think it matters. It doesn't matter. I'm just going to go up, then upright, and then upright. Um, I'm a liar. It did matter. <laughs> uh, this up does not matter. This one does. Yeah. And then it's going to be, I suppose, up. X, X. And then ER from here. The E's are fairly far away, but the R is close. Ish. Is there... I should just go for the other E's, because there's other R's I can get that are closer to the E's. So where am I going to go? I'm going to press left, I guess it would be? No, it doesn't matter. It's roughly the same distance to where I'm going. Is it? Wait, what do I want here? Yeah, no, I guess I will. Okay. Um, sorry, I'll, I'm not actually explaining a lot of what I'm thinking about, am I? I'm happy with that emote, Manly. I, I think it's it was a good choice for my channel. Hey, what happens if I press up and left and right at the same time? It just sends me up. Okay. <laughs> it was worth a check. No, it is faster to go left. Uh, and then it's... No, gosh, it's not, is it? The way this works is so bad. Never mind, it, I think it is up. Up, and then, uh, I guess left, up. And then left, and then up, and then left again. Um... I'm not optimizing it too much. Golf, I swear, what I'm doing right now is not actually optimizing. It may sound like it, but, uh... But you haven't met real tassers. Right, that is what down left does. I want to do down and then left. A? What? Wait. That shouldn't be an A. What? Oh! I missed that tile. That's the A that I took last time. No, that's... Where am I right now? That's an A? That's not a good sign. I missed a letter that I took. Hold on. Hold on. If I go one further left, what is that? That's the R I was after. I took this A and didn't notice. And just to make sure, if I hit left and take... I'm in the wrong thing. If I hit left and take that tile, that's the D? Okay. I think it's just that I didn't mark that A as taken. Okay. Okay, I think we're good. Have a good night, Andre. Thank you for stopping by. Um, okay, so we have the letters for fattier. We could take an A for radial. We're on an A right now. 
Uh, the G's are still not particularly close. H is kind of close, but the, I don't think we're going to beat the A that we're currently on. Um... Gosh, how did I miss that I had already taken that? That's... that bothers me. Uh, X... up... Uh, down left, I guess, on 36. Or right, whatever. Left, what am I saying? Down right, rather. 56, press A. Uh, and then I believe I have the T already selected, so I can just X up 62 to 74. 76, rather. And then it's right, X... Uh, up, and then on 96, X, and then on 00, 02, 16, and then 20, 22, 36, is a lag frame, 38, 40, to 54, what? Wait. Oh. Right, sorry. Up isn't what I meant to do. 42, 44, 58. That's what I wanted. Okay. Uh, when do we get input? Is it like 28 or something? It is 28. Okay. We've taken this V. We've taken more letters. We took both of these E's. The W is the one that's still sitting down there. That's an I sitting down there. Uh, we took this I and T, we took this T, we took that R I already marked, we took this A, we took one of these, this E, this one? Yes, this one, has to be that one. Just refreshing, making sure I... I've marked everything. Yes, I, I have everything marked. And we have the A for radial. Okay. Um, we could get a D or an I. There's an I extremely close that I think I am going to take first, actually. It's the one we're sitting on right now. Uh... Oh. We need a D after that. Which I don't think we're going to get much faster than that. Uh, and then it needs to be... Yeah, another down right actually will work. That D. Uh, and then we need an A, L in some order. We are very close to an A and an L. Oh! Oh, this is perfect! Oh my god, this is so perfect. Because here's what happens. We hit right, and then we hit right, and then we hit X, and then we hit X, and then we hit X. Wait. I'm missing a letter. Wait a minute. I'm only playing five tiles this turn? Is that right? Oh, so I need 
another letter for heinous then um either the e or the i oh and the other is eggnog of course okay i need either e or i for heinous uh i think i can just hit down twice and i'll be good and i'll be good do i want that is that what i want i think it might be better leaving that for now go down left left no, wait, why did down put me there? Hold on. Could also take the S for heinous right now and force myself to get all the other letters in the correct order next time. I'm just gonna do that. I don't wanna overthink this. Also, I just think it's funny that in this case I'm pressing S x four times in a row to build this. Um, where are we? 62? Could do a different word than heinous, but... Eh. The H and S were right next to the AL. There it is. Okay, there's already an A, so it's X, up, 84, uh, go, can do some more diagonal movement if we want for fun, 84 to 94 to 04 to 14 to 24 to 34. Um, yeah, and then 44, just right. 54x. <clears throat> uh, it's a 10-frame window. It's about halfway, I think. Visually halfway. It's here. This is where it is. 10 frames after the movement starts, you can, you can hit x and, uh, and it'll go in. Well, no, that's not right. Ten frames after... Because there's a delay between hitting the button and it visually updating. <laughs> a little less than halfway, I think, is, uh... It's this far. It's however far this is. That's the answer. Because, yeah, it would be nice, uh when you're doing this to, you know, it, it's an optimization. It's one aspect of optimization that we don't think about a whole lot. Welcome back, Muzz. Um, yeah, I hit X. I hit X, I hit right, the next frame, I hit X, I, I hit X, I hit up, I uh, hit, where does this actually go? Goes over there. I forgot about that. I forgot about that aspect of this game. Um, where does the next one go? Are we good? Is this fine? What a nice date in the city. Very nice. Also, that felt really late. No, I guess that was right. It just feels like it's resting there for a little bit, but I guess it has to. Six, oh, 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 two. Okay, yeah, and then the rest of these just work. Okay, this is... This is one aspect of these boards that I don't think we covered when talking about all of the small optimizations. If... You want to play vertically, you place a tile, and then the, the next tile will start on the right, and you need an extra movement to move it down left. However, if you place, if you want to play vertically and you're on the edge of the board, it's actually two movements to get into place, not one. 
Because it, it put the D over below the I in fattier. I don't know how to succinctly say that. But I hope that you all understand what I'm saying. Just on the right side of the board. That's right. That's the only time this matters. I'm going to get some water. My throat is actually very dry. been talking too much. <clears throat> okay. Okay. Where am I? Where am I? Who am I? I uh, hit X to grab to place that. So I'm on 20. Uh 22 to 36. <clears throat> 40 to 42 to 56. And then it's two right presses. Right. <clears throat> Wait, is the starting letter position further away? It's going to be on the edge of the board anyway, and, uh... Yeah, diagonal movement is the same as horizontal. So yeah, theoretically, that, that could work. <laughs> okay. We have H and S for heinous. We need all the letters in order. <clears throat> Unless we want to do uh, scramble strats again. But we do not. We do not want to do that. EI. <clears throat> I'm going to take these ones that are on the top row. So that's right, 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 one more. No, that's right. Oh, wait, I didn't, sorry, I still need to blot out letters. Hold on, I forgot. Uh, because I, I took this I already. That I doesn't exist anymore. Um... That eye doesn't exist anymore, me when I'm fighting the Cyclops. Uh, bunch of letters here I took, that's right. It's these four. These are still gone, that R is still there. Me when I'm blinded. Uh, that's gone. That's one, those, that, that. Five here, W, E, D, Q, I, E, E, Z, A. Okay, I think I got all of them. There's still a big long row here. I'm so worried that I'm making a mistake, but no, I, I got all of them. I definitely got all of them. Okay. <clears throat> Two rights, take the E. Uh, the nearest I might be that one. It might be... No, it's going to be that one for sure. And we're playing through an N... Oh, that's perfect! Okay, sorry. Yeah, this is perfect. Um... After we take the E, we press down, and then we press down, and then we hit X twice. Because we're playing through the N, so that's just correct. 
Uh, then we need a U. And the U, we're going to have to go up. Um, and then left a few times. What does up left do right here? That sends us all the way over there. Golf, does this does this seem right? We're on this tile and we press up left and it sends us up here. I love I love this. Yeah. <laughs> Follow the rules. It's just, it's correct. What could I say? Oh, that's so funny. That's not helpful, though. <laughs> Unfortunately. <laughs> Optimizing this is going to be hilarious for whoever wants to do that. Can we test what real quick, Golf? Which one? What, what direction do you want me to hit? Press down on the fourth row? On the far right tile, sure. Uh, if I press down right now, it sends me there. Here, let me just... I, this is silly. Down sends me, yeah, from here to this one. So yeah, it seems the same. It's checking to the right and then checking to the... Well, it's checking to the right and then trying to go off the bottom, which it can't. So then it checks to the left. Well, yeah, I did, but then I went back up to the fourth row. Oh, actually, no, that's interesting. It went down, tried going to the right, tried going down again, went to the right, couldn't do anything, tried to go down again and couldn't, so then it went left on the bottom row. Which is not what I would have expected. From here and here, going down goes to this tile. Okay, we've taken those, so we actually need to hit up, uh, which sends us there, and then left twice, three times? I can't count. Left, left, we're on an A, so one more. Then we take the U. Do I want to take that U? Yes, I do, because then I can hit up left, and I'm on the S. Uh, I already have the S. No, I don't want that. Hold on, hold on, don't take that S. What word am I starting next? I'm fairly close to the G for eggnog. I could go for an I for inertia. I think inertia is actually the better bet. Uh, because if I just go up right now, I get the I. No, I need to go back further. Hold on. Up right there, take the I. <clears throat> I, I know, Golf. I, <laughs> I, I imagine, oh, it's actually surprising to me that we've almost taken out the entire middle row. <laughs> I just noticed that. Uh, I imagine optimal cursor play there could be very funny. Um, where are we? Ten, maybe? Six? Still works. Uh, that's too early. Oh, 02? Too early. Oh, 04? Oh, 04. Uh, we start with the H, so it is X up. On 20, we can start moving. This is another diagonal for fun. Uh, let's have some more fun. 20 to 30 to 40. Can I go that far down? No, not quite that far. Uh, but I can start doing up lefts to 50, to 60, to 70. Where am I? One more to the left. Um, you know what, actually, in that case, let's make... That's the first one, right? The first up, yeah. Let's just make this a normal up left. There we go. Uh, 
96 to 10. Uh, right up, yeah, the S is the last letter we're gonna play, so we do need to, uh, do need to do that every time to 30. 36 to 40, where we then hit right, and on 60 can hit X. Uh, 66 to 80. Uh, and then we play the S on 84, 86 to 00, and then right and X. There it is. Okay. We have the I for inertia. We need to blot out some more tiles on I chart. Uh, we took that E. We took... What else did we take? We took this I. So there's four spaces there now. We took this U. Took that I and O, so there's a, and that D, so there's a massive gap. Took that D? For radial, yes. I didn't get that before, but yes. Um, those are still there, those are still there. Most of the letters for revenge are still there, which I just think is funny. Uh, yeah, looks like everything else is still in place. Seven letters there. Yep. Okay. About 60% done. We're making a lot of progress. This, it, it start, we start going fast. Considering it was like two hours in before we had the board we're working with now, <laughs> we're making progress. But which eye do I have? The the eye. It's the eye. I need an N or an E. There's gonna be an R eventually. I could take the R that I'm sitting on right now. That wouldn't be that bad. And then get N E in order. Or do I want one of those R's? <clears throat> I think I'll take the R I'm sitting on now. So X to take the R. Uh, that sends me over there. So then I need N E, which I can do by doing down right. Oh my god. Down right. Right. We got we got a lot of information. I, I definitely don't feel like any of this is time wasted. Uh, and then right and then X for the E. And then we're playing through the T and so we need IA. Which we can get. <laughs> Um, all of the eyes are below the middle of the board, so it's gonna be a down no matter what. Um, and then a second down, which is gonna place us on an eye. Uh, do I want to take that eye, or do I want to take the one near it? Because if I take that eye, you know, that that's a way to quickly get to the right side of the board that I'm suddenly losing. Um, and so I'm reluctant to take this eye right now. I think I'd rather go either up than left or up left and right. Oh yeah, no, that is perfect. I want to go, 
uh, from this point down, up, left, right, uh, and then X, and then X, and that gives me the IA for the end of inertia. I'm currently sitting on an O. Can I use that? Is that helpful? Am I near anything helpful? I still need to play Squeeze and Eggnog. Those are my next two choices. So either an S or a G. Um, up is going to send me all the way over there. Actually, hold on. I could go for the, the Q. That's not that far away. I could get the G earlier. I was pretty close to the G's before. Um, although when I do start getting eggnog... Gosh, no, there's no good way to get that. Where is Squeeze gonna leave me after I get the last E? No, I'll play eggnog after Squeeze. I'll, I'll go for the S or a Q. Yeah, Q's not that far away. Is the S going to be easy to get? So there's only the one S left? Did I already play the others? I think there's only the one S left. S is going to be really far away if I get that before the Q. I... I should go for the S think? Should I? No. Gosh, I don't know. Um, where's this gonna send me? Hold on, hold on. Let me, let me just look at this. If I press up, then down right, where does that put me? <laughs> this puts me there! <laughs> I'm sorry. Just... From here, down right, puts me here? Yes, because it's right and then down, obviously. <laughs> this is such a beautiful game. <clears throat> this is so beautiful. Okay. Down, then right then X. That gives me the Q. That's so ridiculous. Yes, I I will. They are pretty simple rules. They're just dumb. They're just really dumb. Yeah, Golf, if you can work up a, a nice write-up for it, um, something we could copy-paste into the Discord and pin, I really appreciate that. Oh yeah, or if you DM it to me, I can I can share it in the Scrabble cord. Or, Golf, if you want to join the Word Game Speedrunning Discord, you are welcome to. It is for all Word Game fans. What am I even playing? I'm playing Inertia. That's way too late. It's going to be on 18. Yeah. And not 16, I already tried that. <laughs> I'm, playing, I'm playing Scrabble. You're right, you're right. You got me. Up on 20, so on 34, and I start going up there. Can do... Uh, let's do upright, and then 44 upright, and then 54 just to the right, and then 64 upright. We have fun here. 74, press X. Uh, right, X, up. On 94, down left, on 04, X, uh, right, X, up, and that should just work. So on 24, X, 
on 28x up on 44x and then IA are in the right order. 40, another lag for, you're kidding. Sad, sadness all around. 52, uh, so 64 down on 74, we hit X. 78, 80, 80. I hit up. Wait, wait, no, what happened? Wait a minute. Oh, that was 52, I'm sorry. On 68, we press down. And unfortunately, we got a lag frame, so that's a really long wait. We got a lot of lag frames this turn, that's unfortunate. Uh, 68 to 78, and then 82, 84 to 98, X. Right, X, that's the turn. <clears throat> Not 66? Yeah, 68. Eight points? Yeah, you're right. Okay. Um, let's blot out the board a little bit. We got that R, we got the Q, we got uh, this IA over here. We got something from here, was it, hold on, it's one, two, three, one, two, and then two spaces, so we got that E. We got, there should only be four here, we got this N for inertia. Uh, there's still seven up top, one, four, one, two, three, one, 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 two, one, two, one, yes, okay, that's everything. Okay, so we need the S for squeeze. We can't get around getting the S right now. <clears throat> Although, what is the fastest way to do that? I think it has to be just going to the right. There's no way you could go... Well? Where does downright put us? That puts us there. And then upright... Puts us there... And then right puts us on the S. Okay. Uh, so we have SQ. The U is right there. Uh, down left will put us on it. Nope. It won't. That's right. Uh, we want down and then left will put us on it. There we go. Is that the U we want? That is going to be the U we want, yeah. And then I only need one E plus the Z plus another E. Hold on, where where am I? I'm here. I will have played SQU. Sorry, I'm just thinking about... Um, You know, tile order stuff. I think... Okay, I think I want to go left here. Uh, take this E, go down. And then left. And then X, and then left, and then left, and then... And then left, and then X. There we go. And that gets me the letter for squeeze. Um, and then I need to start another word. Am I close to the G's for eggnog? I am, actually. I'm extremely close to one of the G's. I will go up. Where does up left put me? Where does up left put me? Up there, on the blank. Yeah, that's not what I want. Uh, where does just up put me? Right there. Okay. Yes, that does make sense. That tracks with the rules. Good. Oh, X. That gives me a G for eggnog. 
Oh. <clears throat> okay. Uh, where where can we go? Ten. Eight. Where wait where am I? Eight. There we go. It's too early. Ten is correct. I want to go right X up. Oh, we do lose a frame from that actually. Uh, if we're starting a turn on the wrong letter, that does lose a frame. It's just if you're in the middle of the word, you can buffer an input to not lose time, needing to move over on your rack. I'm not redoing this word, uh, but that is a point of improvement for the future. Uh, up. 14, 28, we can go up right, uh, and then on 38, we can press X. 2, 44, 58, 62, 64, 78. <coughs> Thank you, golf. I'm going to just copy paste this in the Discord without reading it. And I will trust that Golf is basically right. I can fact check that later with my understanding. I appreciate it. It you did good, Golf. <laughs> I I can show the stream your formatting, yes. Actually, you know what? Yeah, I can uh I can look at this on screen, on stream right now, and check if it matches my understanding. Look at this beautiful formatting that Golf, Golf did. So let's see. PS1 Scrabble letter selection grid rules. When attempting to clear a gap in the grid, there's different behavior when traveling horizontally versus vertically. Attempting to cross a horizontal gap moves you to the next tile available in that row, whether you travel left or right. Attempting to cross a vertical gap does not keep you in the same column, and the behavior is different when moving up versus down. When moving up, you'll be placed on the first available tile left of your starting position. Moving down, you'll be placed on the first available tile to the right. That's right. If there are no valid tiles in the appropriate direction, the sequence repeats on the row, the next row in the direction of vertical travel, right? If there are no valid tiles upon reaching the top or bottom row, You'll be placed on the first available tile in that row while moving in the opposite direction of normal. Yes, that is correct. When inputting both vertical and horizontal directional input on the same frame, horizontal direction will activate before vertical and then follow any gap skipping rules previously explained. Yeah, I think that's right. The only thing I'm not sure about is... Um... No, I guess we do know that. If you try pressing left or right or top or bottom, or up or down on uh, the edge of the board. I don't... Or no, if... Oh, crud. There is a little bit more. If you press up when you're at the top row, it moves you all the way to the left. And if you press down when you're on the bottom row, it moves you all the way to the right. But I think pressing left or right on the edges of the board does not do anything. But I don't know that I actually tested that. I'm not... I'm not positive. Where am I right now? I placed the U. We are on an E. 82 up. 84 to 98. 88 to 08. To 12 to up. To 28. To 32, up to 48. 48. <clears throat> okay, and we have G for eggnog. Eighteen works. 16 does not. Okay. 
we got this G, we got this EU, we got this EZ, To, we got this S. So there's five spaces. There's four here. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> what is the fastest movement here? We're gonna need that N. <laughs> Where's the other? I have the other G. Right. Oh, this is perfect. Okay. Um. And what do we need after this? DW for dwarves? And is this the last D? It looks like it is. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Things fall apart catastrophically, right. Okay, so we're gonna go down, right, right as soon as we can again. X, and that's gonna send us there, where we then go up, X, 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 and get Nog, Eggnog. Um, and then we're gonna press, ooh, how do we wanna do this? I was thinking DW, no, yeah, I definitely need I do want a D next, so I do need to go all the way to the bottom of the board. Okay. Uh, just no matter what, there there are no other words I can go at right now. Yeah, I've done everything else. But once we have dwarves, then options open up again for the last three words. Uh, but yeah, we definitely need to move down a few times. I don't think it matters if we pressed... Down left or down right, I think we're kind of stuck here. You know what? Actually, real quick. Sorry, real quick. Let's check the thing that I just wasn't sure about. Ooh. Okay, no, golf, there are more rules. There are rules for pressing left and right. Um. <laughs> I should have just checked this at the start <laughs> when the board was full. Pressing right on this moved me here, and pressing left on this moved me here. So I'm gonna go ahead and guess, like how pressing up at the top moves you left and down at the bottom moves you right, pressing right on the right moves you down, and pressing left at the left moves you up. That, that makes sense to me. Um, no matter what, though, we are, we are a little stuck. Uh, we, yeah, after next turn, we can take that R. Sheeps, sheeps do make sense. They make so much sense. Good sheeps. Uh, yeah, we're completely stuck on that R until next turn when we get it out of the way. Which I assume we'll do that next turn, but I don't know, maybe not. I suppose we don't have to. Um, another down? Where, where are we? We're there. Left? What's left gonna do here? That moves us up. Left moves us up? Wait, no. No, 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 no. That's not right. Okay, never mind, Golf. I take it back. I don't know how anything works. Left from this tile moves us up a row. But left from here moves us this way. We're just, we're playing Scrabble. You know how Scrabble works. We're tassing Scrabble. I, I know what all of these letters are. I've been, I've been keeping track of them. Um, and I have a board that I'm building. We're in the tile picking phase right now, though. We're getting the right tiles for the next turn. That's what we're doing. Okay, we press down again. And then we press down one more time. <clears throat> and then we press left. 
and then we press left one more time, and then we press X two times. Here you go, Eliza. I think this should look more like a Scrabble board. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Eggnog. Also, thank you, Orange Triangle, for putting the word egg on this board. That also only just occurred to me. I'm sure that will make a number of people very happy. I don't know if that was on purpose, but well done. Okay. Uh, X, select the tile. Up. Then 06. Uh, then... We get to do a little more diagonal movement for fun. Egg pit. Yes. I think that was it. That sounds right. 06. 16. Just two? Two, three, four, five, six? Maybe? I don't know. I can't count. Uh, 26. 36. 46. 56. 66 down? Yeah, there we go. And 76x. Semi-intentional. Okay. I'll take it. Um, oops. X. X up. Uh, 82 to 96. 1400, 1402, 216, 20, 22, 36, 40, 42, 56. And then I can do two left presses. It doesn't actually matter. They are the same. What does pressing down do at this point? Nothing. Okay, good. <laughs> I just... Is there anything else? Crud. Let me take a second and make sure I know what all the buttons do. Not what I wanted. Don't remove word from board, please. Circle. Zooms out. Square shuffles. Uh, down, up goes onto the board. Does that, that pauses. Okay. Okay. No, I don't think there's a faster way to go over to end turn. That's all I wanted to know. Uh, so yeah, let's go ahead and just do two left presses for fun, because we can. Is that... Yeah, no, that's right. Is the shuffle deterministic? It appears to be based on the number of frames the game has run. We were looking at that earlier. Uh, actually, the reason that we played modesty or modest in the first turn is because we rolled into it and we did shuffle strats to play it quickly. Strongyloidosis? Oh, how did you miss that? Left up. Can't find anything to move to the first active tile. The last active tile. Maybe, though. I don't know. I... I need to do more testing to figure out exactly what happens with that. It's... it's weird. Uh, what about 60? Nope. What about 62? No. 64. 64 is the first one. Okay. Just played Eggnog. We need to play Dwarves. I need to clear the board again. We got Nog. We got that G. 
So we have three, one, both of those. We have all of those. We have that R still. Those two, we got the DW. One, one, two, one, one. Okay, yeah, we're good again. <clears throat> so we have DW. Um, where's the V? The V's over there. We don't need the R for dwarves. Uh, okay. There are three R's left? We do need the R for dwarves. We're not playing dwarves through unaired. I'm... I'm tired. I'm hungry. I never ate dinner. Okay. We need A-R-V-E-S. The V is actually very close. So I could go get away with V-A-R. E? Yeah, I think that's the play. So uh, what we're going to do, we're going to go down right, because that puts us right on the V. Golf, that sounds so good. I... What am I going to do? I don't want to go through all the effort of making chicken parm at midnight. But I do have chicken in the fridge thawed that I should eat tonight. I mean, I could just grill the chicken on the stove. That's still a perfectly good meal. I'll figure it out. Okay, uh, we do that. We need the A next, which fortunately is right there. Uh, and then we press down and then X again. And we got the R. That sends us to the bottom, naturally, where we then press uh, left. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, sorry. We press left and X and uh, X. And that's it. And that's the I for dipolar. Uh, where are we on 90? We're good. What about 88? Not good. And 90 is the first frame. I'm gonna save it again. It's been a bit. Of the full tile set? Yeah, like Five Crab says, it's in the, the Discord. Which, do I have a link to that Discord on my page anywhere? I I forget if I would put one on or not. Um, dwarves. We pressed X to select it. That's my Discord. I, no, I forget if I, uh, if I put it, well, first of all, real quick. I should just make a command for that. Um, I mean on my page, though, like down under where my panels are, I have a link to, I think, the N++ Discord, maybe? And maybe the some other Discord, I think. I don't remember. I'm focused on the task. I'm not thinking about that. Select, uh, up, 06. We, again, get to do a little bit of silly movement. Um, six, sixteen, twenty-six, twenty-eight, thirty-eight. 26, 28, 38, which if I counted right should line up. 48, uh, 58, 68, and that's it. That is right. 78. Uh, 82, two frames, 84 to 98, down left to 08, X, 
write x up from 14 to 28, x, x up to 48. Oh, wait, no, sorry, forgot another right press. To 48. Dwavris. Uh, 48, I pressed it, so 52, 54, 68. Um, 72, 74, 88, right, X, that's the turn. <clears throat> Look at how little's left. We're doing great. There it is, 58. Okay, dipolar, we have the I, we need either a P or an O. Oh, I haven't uh, removed tiles yet, hold on. Uh, we took the V, the A, the R, these bottom, E, I, Two, one, one, two, one, one, that, that, that. Yes, okay, that's everything. <clears throat> okay. Uh, the P... O would be faster to get through, but there's also an O near the P. Ugh. Hmm. I think I should just press down twice. Where does that put me? It does put me there. That's not that bad. Okay. So let's go right here and then right again and then X to take that O and then right again and then to take the P. We're sitting on an N, but we need to get an L, which is gonna be left a little bit. Um, one more. Can I do a full run through from beginning to end? Absolutely, yes. Uh, that's an L, or that's a D, not an L. One more left. That's an L. Uh, where does up put me from here? That's good, actually. Where does up left put me from here? Up there, that's better. Take it, take it, it's dipolar, and then either unaired or airflow, we need either an A or a U. We are sitting there. A is closer. Dipolar. We got the X up from 18 to 32. Uh, that's... Where can we go from here? I don't know. Up left. Um, 32 to 42, to 52, what's up, Manly? To 62, to 72, how far is that? A little further. Uh, 82, 92, up? Yeah, there we go. You've cracked the code. Tell me the code. Oh, 
08 to 22. Uh, 26, 28 to 42. To 46, to 48, to 62. <clears throat> um, oh, and dipolar gets us a triple word. Yeah. And we knew that that was going to happen. I assume. <laughs> Okay, uh, 62 to 66 to 68 to 82 86 88 to 02 to right X. There we go. <clears throat> and that's the other discretion, right? Uh, it's this, golf. It's effectively this. Oh, wait, do you mean including... Sorry, no, no. Do you mean including double letter and triple letter? Because, yeah, no, I, I guess, yeah, golf is asking something different than we're doing. Because we're also trying to play a lot of tiles at once. If you stuck entirely to, like, three and four letter words, you could probably skip almost everything except the middle square. Um, I, I assume that's been done in the past. That is different than what we're doing. That hit nothing besides the star ones? That's neat. Okay, where are we? I don't know, 42? That's super late. 38? <laughs> I guess it wasn't super late. It was either right or one frame off. There we go. 40 is the first frame. Okay. Um, what did we take? We took a bunch of these. We took that A, both of these, this A and R. Uh, we took L, D, and O. And O? No, not the D. That's the D. This is D. It's right there. That's the D that's going to go in unaired. Um, we took the P for dipolar, and that's it. Okay. <clears throat> we are making airflow. How do I want to do this? I'll look at it in just a minute, Manly. Wait a minute. Oh, we're playing into the W, right, oh my god. I just had a moment of thinking like, wait, there's no W left. <laughs> yes, no, this works, okay. <laughs> Um, these tiles aren't really in a great position. I'm gonna look at what Manly sent now, because my... I need to just refresh my brain for a second. <laughs> oh, Manly, this is good art. This is very good art. Man, like, that art is amazing. I love it. Yes, we can we can all see the art. Um, for the people who may want to uh, to optimize board movement, is this diagram helpful? So like if you're here and you press right, it sends you down here. If you're here and you press right, it sends you here. If you're here or here and you press right, 
it sends you down to this one. But if you're on this one and you were to press right, it sends you here. Down, of course, just sends you this way. Down from here sends you to the right. What are the purple arrows? Manly, what is this purple arrow? Manly. The purple was a yellow. Right, okay, so... No, it can't be a yellow, because yellow is this way. Is it ignore the purple arrow? <laughs> ignore the purple, gotcha. I am just gonna post this in the Scrabble Discord as well. The Scrabble Discord can make use of it what they will. Okay. Oops. Okay. Back to this. What order am I going to get these in? If I were to take R before I, I would take this one, which would send me to the O, and I would go down here for the I. The thing that's frustrating is I'm starting on the F. The F is right here. So I kind of want to take this first. The letters are just, like, in perfectly bad places for, uh, for me to do this quickly. I think I am going to go F first, then down, then down again. Is down left something that I would want? Hold on. Where does down left put me from here? Also there. Where does... Yeah, it doesn't matter, just down, then left. Or then, down again, rather. Uh, then left. And that puts me on an I, which I will take. And then up, which puts me back on the O, and left, which puts me on the R, uh, which I take. Um, that puts me on a U. What? Wait, where am I? What? I go up from here. I didn't think that would put me on the R. That's fine. That's a good thing. That is what I want. Um, air. Then I would play the F. Then I can take this O. Which puts me down there. That's fine. Um, that's fine. I go up. Puts me there. I go left. I take it. I go left. I take it. Where am I playing airflow? It's up there. Okay. X. <clears throat> up. My air is low. <laughs> Into the W of dwarves. So I'm gonna have to go from 88 to 92. Start hitting up left to 12 to, where, where am I going? It's, it's one extra up in here. So 12 to 22 to 32 to 42 to 52. That's right. Place it on 62. Right, X up on 82. 
write x up on O2, uh, x up on 22, write x up on 42, um, x up 62, write x. Okay, chat, here's the question. Do I want to menu through this, or do I want to take all of the tiles and do scramble strats to, uh, to play them quickly? You know what? It depends a little bit on the order I get them. Let's, uh... Let's, let's see where the... Because honestly, just taking them in the order I'm getting them here might be fine. You over for that, then the A, then over for that. This is fine. This is a good order. <laughs> this just works. You know what, if I want, I could put them in order on my rack, I bet. Can I? Would get... Oh, maybe. I, it doesn't matter. I don't think it would, because I can buffer inputs. I can, I can buffer inputs to move over one tile at a time on this menu without losing time. But I can't for the first one, which is the blank, so I don't think I can at all. So I'm not going to worry about it. Undies! <laughs> we got undies! <laughs> uh, 72. Doesn't work. 74. Does work. Last turn, last turn. Let's save it one more time. <laughs> Out of curiosity, uh, what does shuffling the board put it at? Not a helpful, not remotely helpful. It's already in a good place. We don't need it. Up. Um, this is going up, so that's 76 to 90. To O O to ten to twenty and that's it? That's it. To thirty. To fifty. Um to Yeah, I guess this is right. Fifty four fifty eight. I know. Um, and that. Oh, I forgot to do up. Oops. Do X to. No, wait. Oh my god, what am I doing? That places the N. This picks up the blank. This moves the blank. This places the blank. That selects A. Okay. Right? No, I- what am I doing? Oh my god, I need to wait! I'm silly. 56 to 60. No, to- yeah, to 60. To 70. Oh my god. Frying my brain trying to do all of this. X. Four frames. X. That places it. There we go. <laughs> uh, then four more frames? Unaired. That's the A, next is the I, so right, X, yeah, up. Uh, that's 80 to 94 to uh, 96, because we're pressing right again, to 1600, 1600, 600, to 14, we need to press right, and then X on 24. Uh, and then 
x and up, and on 44, place the last tile, on 48, we hit end turn. We did it. We did it. It was all me. Nobody else did any work. Time ends. Well, okay, time ends for Tasses on last input, but time ends for... I'm kidding. I'm kidding, obviously. I did, like, the least amount of work of anyone in this community for this. I'm the one who has used Tass Studio before. That's what I brought to this. Eliza did it, obviously. Okay, save. Um... Let me just mark down what the, the final frame... Well, I can just type it here. Uh, game over. Uh, this is almost the part where we watch it in full speed. I need to figure out where we started. When does the screen first go black? That's what I care about. There, 2829. 2829 to 181888. Eight, eight, minus 2829 is that, divided by 60, is 255 seconds, which is 4 minutes and 15 seconds? Is that, did I do that math right? No, I'm not going to save my work. I'm just going to delete it. Don't worry. Uh, let's go. Let's go back from power on. Save. And watch it desync, and then watch me cry. Okay. Uh, do I even have sound on this? I think this might have been silent the whole time. Test Studio. How loud is it? It's not that loud. Okay. Yep, we get to watch it all now. But five crap, can you clear the opening screens that fast? Oh, that's true. This is also with manual tile selection. Uh, don't worry about the audio clipping, that's just Task Studio being- making the game run slower than normal. When I actually export this to a video, it'll sound normal. Yeah, this is slowing down a lot. Task Studio does this. Oh my god, it's getting so bad. <laughs> I 
I mean, we saved at least. I wonder if this would still happen in more recent versions of BizHawk, because this is an older version. And I think the problem is, you see this counter at the bottom that says states, and it's just constantly counting up? It's that as we're playing it, it's keeping track of save states at different times. And it does not need to be doing that right now. <laughs> Do we want to try to finish watching this? Because I'm pretty sure... With the rate it's slowing down, I have a suspicion that if I tried to solve this problem and then played it back from the start, it would finish before it'll finish at this rate. Yeah, hold on. How... what can we do about this? I've already saved. I'm saving it again, just because I should save it again. Yeah, I'm just gonna export the task. That's... that's what I should do. Okay. Uh, we export to BK2. We export to Banjo-Tooie. Does the menu come up for that, or does it just... does it just do that? Hold on. Uh, no, it just did it. Perfect. Uh, I think, if I remember right, we can just close Task Studio? I think we can just close Task Studio? Uh, we can reboot Core. Don't need to worry about that. We can play Movie? Is that what I want? Why isn't it bringing up a menu? Why... Oh, it's trying to crash, that's why. Oh, there it goes, okay. Uh, this is what we want. That one... That one? Yeah, that one. Um... Yes. Okay, and then... Uh, I'm also going to say record. Uh, as an mp4, and I'll save it, sure, just as that, I'll rename it later. And I believe now, when I hit start, it should just play like normal. And this is also actually recording it to an mp4 that I will then put on YouTube or whatever. I'll leave it. No reason to, to fiddle with it now. I'll save again. Do you guys remember this part of the TAS? I... I don't remember TASing this. Now BizHawk is crashing. Okay, okay. I think, uh... I think I might just try to do this... Do this offline, in that case. Um... Huh. That's a surprise? That's a surprise. Did not expect that to happen. 
I saved. I have the everything. Why isn't it letting me delete this? Do I have... Is Bizhawk still running in the background trying to do something? It's not letting me delete the, uh, the file that it tried to make. Huh. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I can look at doing that, too. I think I'm gonna call the stream there. It's been nearly five hours, and I haven't had dinner, and I expected this to be done three hours ago. So I'm gonna find someone to raid. Let's see. Who's around? Infinity Words is doing Scrabble, kinda. Is it too late to cook now? Ah, uh, No, you definitely didn't have anything to do with it. This also just took longer to make than I expected. I ended up uh, trying to optimize the tile picking more than I thought I would, and there was also a bunch of stuff before I even started playing that I ended up doing. It's looking like a Critter Vision night to me. Also, again, I had lunch at like 4.30, so... If I was really bothered and hungry, I would have just stopped and eaten a while ago. But yeah, I'll, I'll let everybody know when, uh, when I have everything put together. Uh, yeah, have a good night, everybody.